Okay. Things looking good. So I'm still in jail. Now the question is, did they fix it? The guard is the escape mechanic. Do I sound okay? Uh, I think it. I th I think it looks fine. I think the sound should be fine. If not, someone let me know. All right. Fuck, my gear is still all broken, eh? Fuck. I'm at negative 17. And that guy's still there, but he doesn't have the uh, buff anymore. That was making him invincible last time. So I wonder if this means we can kill him now. Who is this? Oh, that's a player. Never mind. Alright, let me repair the gear first. 18 go to repair in here. Like bra. Oh wait. Oops. Oh, is it? Since what was the red in here? I never noticed that there was actually red down here. I thought it was only... I guess that makes sense. It's like mostly black, white, and red. I never noticed this on my outfit, though. I think I had, like, a trial uh, premium outfit or something, which is why it was a different color. But now uh, this is the uh, proper color. Alright. So I'm guessing... I wait... I, I should heal up first, before. All right. Wait, did I? Oh fuck! I forgot. Oh shit! Damn, I forgot. If you have to do the, the fucking thing first, you have to go take the stone to him, and then he gives you the buff. It's been like a week, and I already forgot. Damn. I mean, what's the point, though? Why does he even need a stone if the whole point is to escape? <laughs> Alright. So this is the buff I need. Alright, let's see if I can kill this guy now. How hard is he to kill? He doesn't seem that difficult. Oh, he could be CC'd. I mean, I guess that depends if he's actually a threat or not, but it doesn't really look like it. Actually, he was pretty easy to kill. I thought he was going to be like... As difficult as a player, maybe. But no, that was much easier than I expected. Okay, so I got the official seal now. No, that's not it. Wait, what official? Oh, this is it. A seal for Pruwu, which contains the spell for breaking the enchantment of the Realm of Destiny. Click to activate the spell. Hmm. Oh, wait, where am I supposed to go? I'm assuming here, right? Because this is like... The seal? It says to restore my skills. So do I have to go through this, or do I just teleport out immediately? That's the question. Oh, okay. Looks like I was correct. I go through here. Or was I correct? Ooh. 
It looks like it's not so simple. I still have to kill some guards on the way out. Not just some guards. It's like a whole platoon of them. Okay. They're actually uh, pretty difficult guards too. You can tell because they have the laser sight. <laughs> Okay. Maybe I should activate my thing. These things are tanky. What the fuck? Am I not supposed to kill them? Maybe? Oh my god. Okay, so I think I'm I don't need to I think okay, I think I get it. Like the tower mobs, I don't think I'm supposed to kill them. I think I should avoid the tower mobs. And then kill kill these ones that walk around. Because these ones are like significantly easier to kill. Okay, let me heal up real quick. Oh wait, what? You've got to be kidding me. You can't even heal up in here. Okay, let me just let me just make a run for it. But I don't know if I can kill this guy. He has 84k HP. No, I think I have to kill him. Wait, are these guys not gonna be aggro me? I think I totally misplayed this. If I knew this was going to happen... I don't think I should have uh, ran for it. I should have like took them out one by one. But I didn't know that you can't even heal once you get in here. Maybe I should have actually gotten some pots too. Okay, I'm just gonna run and then try to go for the stuns. Just try to just try to chip him to death. Not take any risks. Like, this guy is actually hard. Oh fuck! Fuck! That that was like the range of the entire thing. Bro, he's not gonna- is he not gonna die? Fuck! He did 600 damage. Oh my god. What did he even do? Like, he- Was he even a- It didn't even look like he was attacking me. He was just kind of standing there. Okay. Okay. I think technically those are PvE mobs, right? So I really should be switching to my PvE gears. Yeah, maybe I really should have switched them in PvE gears.
Man, that kind of sucks. I thought at the end there, that guy kind of looked like he was a standing there. But he just did 600 to me right away. I didn't even see him attack. And now I have to wait 10 minutes for it to respawn. I don't know if I want to necessarily do that, though. Um, I've already been here before. I think I'm going to switch to the other character, maybe. And then come back in 10 minutes. Although it has been... No, there's only two minutes remaining. Wait, do I have less HP while in the PvE gear? Wait, but I do have less HP in the PvE gear. Which one's actually better? So this is like... Actually, my PvE gear... My PvP gear is better than PvE gear, even in PvP, I think. Hey, what's up, man? Yeah, I have more HP in the PvP gear. And I have more more of everything, so I think I just stay stick with the PvE gear. Well, I tried to escape jail, and I actually failed to escape. Because I didn't realize that you can't heal while escaping. And I didn't understand the um, mechanics. Yeah, so no, I'm waiting another, I think, I think he should respawn again another one minute, probably. Because I killed him. And I got the leather, so now I think I just need to try it again. But this time, knowing what to expect. I wonder if I can buy pots. I'm caught spending 9 gold every time. Um, decently useful. Inventory expelled negative chi. The fuck is this? Secret recipe. Yeah, no, none of these are really useful. So now the guy should have respawned again. I think even if this guy is trying to. Kill him, it should still be fine, I think. I think it drops multiple letters. Or maybe it did, I don't... Oh no, wait, wait, I was right. Wait, I'm dumb then. I could have just picked up this other letter that he dropped. Or C or Azer. He drops like two. But I think I am on the right track. I think I am supposed to go here. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be down there. Because this is the only place that has a seal. So this time I need to post smaller groups. And probably prep some in advance. The thing is, I don't know if there's a time limit. Like, how long can I be in here before they decide to wreck me? I think I'm F3 here. And maybe even F1 here. Okay. Now I now I try now I tried to target this guy down. Okay, he's down. No, I now I target this guy down. Oh fuck. 
he actually hurts even if he just hits me regularly. I can't, I can't be that close to him, even though he's ranged. He's still threatening at melee. I need to stun lock him, I think. Let me... Let me just regenerate off him. Okay. Now, can I avoid those guys? I feel like I might be able to, actually. Oh, fuck. Never mind. Nope. It looked like I could have avoided them, but the answer was no. Okay. Target him. Just go for the stun. Stun lock. Wait. I couldn't stun lock him. Let me just dodge. Die already. This guy is so tanky. Okay. So that's the first stage. Well, actually, that's the only stage. Now I have to deal with these two. Try not to lose any HP here. This is just two I shouldn't. But also trying to not have to use my buffs yet. Or actually, that was stage one. This is stage two. Okay, so the situation here is kind of the same. I'm gonna go and build up. And then now I can stun lock him. Okay, he's being stun locked. At least they're mobs, so I can like just randomly knock them down sometimes. I don't really know how that mechanic works yet. Okay. Okay. I'm doing way better this time. Now, to kill the mini boss. Let's build up some of this. Actually, oh wait, I didn't need to use all of them. I didn't use my F2. I was like, let's let's just let's just burst them down. I can't meditate. Unless I did something wrong. Let me I'll try it again. But I couldn't meditate earlier. that thirty four percent okay got the stun stun again actually I can't stun again I wonder if there's like a it's like BDO, where you can only stun them every so often, or something. Because I noticed that if I like try to stun them right after the previous time we were soft, it doesn't work. I'm not 100% sure how that works yet. Okay, he dies here. Okay, let me try meditating again, because I couldn't meditate earlier. For some reason. Okay, I'm good here, I guess. Maybe you can meditate here, but not earlier. Okay. So now... Maybe that was the end. Maybe that's why I could meditate. Yeah, that was the end, actually. Hmm. Okay. So here I escape. But what happens now?
But what happens now? Yeah, but what happens now, you know? What? A cutscene? Huh? Wait, what happens here? Why is there a cutscene after escaping? What's going on? The fuck? That was so random. Ooh. But that's bad. I ha see, I have is. Oh my god. I'm, st I'm still being, um. I have escaped, so I am being hunted. See, I'm at negative 150, uh, negative 150 karma now for escaping. You go negative 150 for escaping. What the fuck? Wait, is this a meme? Wait, that's actually a meme. I was at negative 17, now I'm at negative 150. For escaping. And I have the level 3 debuff. Yeah, I have the level 3 lightning debuff. You have escaped from the realm, you are being hunted. You can barely suppress it, has spread everywhere. HP attack, negative 50% HP, negative 50% attack power. Kill monsters. Uh, where, where would I go for a monster, actually? I don't even know. Where even am I? How to make a Twitch account. Welcome. Wait, where am I? Oh, I'm here. Actually, I've never been here before. So, where do I even go to kill monsters, though? The pills to remove negative chi? I don't think that's the same thing. This is evil chi, not negative chi. I think evil chi and negative chi are two different mechanics. The debuff? That's not... Do you think so? Well, actually, well, we could try and find the merchant. I, just, I don't actually know if there might be guards here, though. Yeah, Twitch kept saying you're a bot. Damn, today I learned. You're actually a bot. How do I tell if these are guards or just normal NPCs? If they're red, there are guards, maybe? Okay, then. But these guys, these are mobs, right? You think if I kill the mob, I get chi back? Or I get, um... I get, a uh, Positive chi, you think? Maybe we'll try it. Let's see what happens. Bro, I have negative 50 attack powers. These ones are actually not taking damage. And I'm also being stunned. <laughs> while, at, while trying to kill this one mob. What did I get? Nothing. I, I did not get any positive chi for that. And I have to meditate. Do you think there's a general merchant? General trader. What if I go here? Do you think he sells the thing that the other guy was selling? I feel like I I, I felt like I seen it before. Oh, fuck it, since we're already here. Might as well kill that guy. Damn, he's actually- I don't care. I already lost track of him.
God damn it. Where did he go? According to the minimap, he's right here, but I don't see anyone. Damn, the fact that you have to uh, channel your rampage rather than just doing it. It says there's someone over here, though. Actually, it says there's multiple people here. Are these guards or are they players? I don't see anyone. I wonder if those are guards. Wait, are these guards? White Bridge? I think these are guards, right? Oh, okay. That's Mystic Guardian. So these ones have to be guards. Yeah, these, these ones all have to be guards, I think. But they're not red. But I mean, Mystic Guardian. So I can't actually go in there. See if they attack and go back to jail immediately. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, this guy doesn't attack. Oh, no, he attacks. Yep, nope, those ones attack. Oh my god. I blame... I blame you for this. I, I blame you for this. Hey, what's up, Koyo? Well, it's a good thing I managed to get away. Because somehow they did zero damage. Last time they one-shot me instantly. I wonder if that's RNG. Like, maybe when they catch you, they only has a random chance to uh, one-shot you. Is this all another guard? Because that's not a player. No, wait, that's just a mob. Never mind. Wait, are, are, this is all. Is this safe zone? No, this isn't safe zone. Bro, with 50% less damage, I cannot do any damage. And 50% reduced damage. Alright, well, I guess I just wait. Because I could spawn in the Realm of Destiny, but I don't have to. I could just wait. Wait, I can just respawn right here. Now I'm a negative, like... Negative 70%. Are you kidding me? And, wait, what the fuck, man? Because that's the that's the red name penalty in this game. If you have red name, at um, there's three tiers. If you have max red name tier, you get three debuffs. One debuff that constantly stuns you and does damage. 
one debuff that gives you negative 50% HP and negative 50% damage. And then apparently when I respawn, I also get another debuff that gives me minus 20%. So I'm at negative 70% HP and damage right now. And I'm constantly being stunned. player worse in this game than BDO? Uh, yeah, I don't think this game is meant for you to go red at all, to be perfectly honest. Like, I see this game kind of like, you know those, um, it's just those esports game, you know, where you just queue in. Like, this is just like one of those games built, baked into the MMO. And you're just supposed to queue. Or PvP, you're not supposed to like go red. But there is like an open world map though. The problem is, I'm at negative 150 just for escaping. That's max red name. It's gonna take like eight hours to uh, fix this character at this rate. So I might just have to end up making a new character. Shit, what's the guy that repairs again? Was it the weapon stealer? Bro, I, I was... Everything is broken. I don't even know where to go to repair. I guess I just go there. I don't think this debuff's going away. I think this might be the uh, thing that you're talking about, Van, the Shroud and Negative Chi. I think that thing gets rid of this, maybe. Can you even kill people like this, though? And it's 18 gold per repair. <laughs> I think I'm just going to die to lightning. At this rate. Yeah, I'm taking 300 lightning hits. Yeah, I don't think there's really any reason why you would ever go red. I think, like... You're just meant to... Like, if you go red, you're just try, you're just here to, like, troll one person. And then, uh, go AFK for the night. <laughs> I don't think it's a legitimate playstyle. Can I kill him, even, with, with this much debuff? Oh, and, and I aggro the guard. Yeah, that was not a good idea. Yeah, that's definitely negative 70% HP debuff, alright. Or damage debuff, alright. 
normally that normally the um that would do like half their HP at least. But I think that would do like thirty percent. I think it's just time to make a new character now. Um, yeah. Why am I back in prison? I respawned back in prison. I'm just gonna log out of this character. But before I do that, I want to check one thing. Was it that, um... Was it that item that Ben was talking about actually does what he said it what he thinks it does? What was it? Yes, yeah, sir, sir, uh, sincerity pill cancels out negative chi infection. No, see, I think this is a PVE item. Yeah, I think this is a PVE item. It cancels out negative chi infection, which inflicts monsters in the wild. I don't think it's a player thing. Yeah, see, this cancels out the malix ma malig malignant. Fuck, how do you pronounce this word? Which infit uh, see, all of these are inf infit uh, inflicts monsters in the wild. So I don't think these are anything to do with the negative karma pills. Yeah, this is just... I pronounced it correctly? Damn. Damn, so seeing words where... I know what it means, but I have never had to say it out loud before. <laughs> um, but yeah. Yeah, these are definitely PvE items. So I so this is as fuck now. So the only thing to do now is to bring this character up here. And then, uh, just log out and play my Reaper. <laughs> and then, uh, over uh, later tonight, I will, uh, AFK, like the BDO days. That's, that, that's about it for this guy. <laughs> Uh, well, I mean, it's kind of, I feel like it's kind of debatable whether or not I could play even if I don't die, though. Like, can you really kill people when you're being stunned every 10 seconds, though? Like, you you will have to outgear them. Like, you're getting 50% debuff. So you, you lose 50% of your damage and your HP, and you're being stunned every 10 seconds. So you would actually have to have double their gear in order to, like, actually beat someone. Which means you literally can't win other than uh, being gear carried. But that's like all of, all of that's good for. But you can't really be gear carried in this game, because I mean if you PvP, then you get gear, so I feel like anyone who actually wants to PvP probably wouldn't be under geared from a PvP standpoint. Well, we'll see if that's true or not. I guess it's time to uh, speed run again to level 37. Fucking hell. See, it wouldn't have even really been that bad if, like, 
I, if like I just got sent back to jail. Because I, because I was at negative 17 only. The thing is, if you go, if you escape jail, you automatically get max negative karma. Just by escaping. Like you can be at zero or negative one. And if you escape, you instantly go to negative 150. Like that, that, that's what really fucked it up for me. Wait, what the fuck? Why is the... Why is the, um... Subtitle in Chinese? I, I get if you make a Chinese voiceover, but the subtitle is also in Chinese? Doesn't that kind of defeat the whole point? Damn. Meanwhile, Sam is actually uh, doing facts and PvP right now. So I just I just need the fastest way. You're not gonna play into open beta. Seems fine with me. You're gonna be missing out on the PvP though. I guess you're have fun playing Spellbreak. I guess you can always play Spellbreak with Chase. Chase is looking for people to play Spellbreak with all the time. Damn, wouldn't play Spellbreak with Chase even if there's nothing else to do. Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Damn, and this is a fail speed run so far. I've already been at this um, in CBT1 for like five hours or six hours. And so I've only been level 22, 24. I'm gonna hit max level again. Oh, that's what I'm trying to do. I mean, aside from just Reaper. I also want to test to see if um, Spearmaster and Spellsword are any good. Because I don't really know what class to play right now. Like, Berserker is nice and all, but... I'm not really feeling the whole summon thing. The, the shade summoning mechanic. I don't know, I'm not really feeling it that much. It's pretty unique though. But I feel like it would be better served with more of a pure melee character. Like it has the... Like you could just use the charge style. But apparently the charge style is bad right now. And it's not going to be buffed on release probably, so... Also, I'm not really sure what I'm doing with the Reaper. Like, 
I feel like I'm just spamming War Moon. Like how I'm spamming R RMB when I was playing Berserker, but I don't know if that might actually be just optimal DPS for PvE, whereas PvP is different. Because I feel like spamming RMB was highly effective in PvE, actually. Maybe even more effective than summoning Shades. But in PvP, not so much. Actually, speaking of which, maybe I should have switched to the uh, RMB spam when I was doing the escape. Damn, I'm still still stuck in the fly animation. You know, they may have said that they made it easier to go from uh, 33 to 36. It's not going to really matter to me because I'm not even 33. How am I feeling Reaper skills? Well, I'm just mostly spamming Warming right now. I feel like this class might have some emphasis on damage over time though, I'm not sure. Because right now, the mechanic is... Um... Actually, hold on. Let me Let me go to this person first. It's like, you have this skill, which does damage based on um, a stack, and basically every time you hit them, you stack the debuff. And the more times you hit them, the more times it stacks. And after a certain number of hits, you can do this, which uh, does damage based on the number of stacks they have. So that's one mechanic. And then you have this mechanic, which does like damage over time. And you can like keep refreshing this with this skill. And then this skill is also a mechanic where if you charge up your middle thing, I think they call it incantations. Which you can charge up just by like attacking people. Then this also does more damage. So it's like you kind of go a mix of DOT plus normal attacks to charge up incantations. Plus this for burst damage to reset the DOT. And then once you do enough hits, you do this as an execute to finish them off. I feel like that's kind of the playstyle, but I could be wrong. But that's that's kind of what it seems like right now. I'm not 100% sure though. I, I, I haven't looked at any of the Astro Blessings yet. And actually there's like more Astro Blessing for Reaper than Berserker. Because, um, you know how Berserk only has two? Reaper has, like, three. So there's, like, um, three styles for Reaper, or it's only two styles for Berserker, potentially. But then again, one of them could just be bad. So who knows? But of course, the thing is, like, like, I feel like in this game, PvE is just not the same as PvP. Like, in PvE, like, I don't feel like the DOT, like, the the wheel, wheel frost, the um, execute skill, like, I don't feel like they do anything. But then, that's kind of like how, the, I, how I felt like as well with Berserker. Like, in Berserker, I didn't feel like any of them did anything until when we did the PvP. Then that's when it turns out, like, the summons and shades actually does a lot. A lot more than RNB, because in PvE, I felt like RNB was the main damage. But then in PvP it turns out that was like far from the case. That was it was kind of the opposite. So I don't know if for Reaper, 
we're gonna kind of get the same situation again, where in PvE, it's like you just spam War Moon, but in PvP maybe it's completely uh, like who knows some other mechanic. Like maybe I would even switch to a different Astro Blessing. Like this might actually be the PvE Astro Blessing. I don't know if that's the thing. Like I don't know if some of the Astro Blessing might be more optimized for PvE and some might be more optimized for PvP or not. And that's just Reaper. I'm not really sure about uh, Spearmaster and Spellsword yet. Those could also be equally interesting. But supposedly Spearmaster has, um, has mobility or something like that. And if that's the case, then that might not be my class. Because I like it when there's more mobility. But also, supposedly, Reaper has the most mobility. Which so far I haven't really seen. But I'm also only level 24. I guess I have Block Jump. Wait, I actually have not seen this skill yet at all. I haven't tested this one yet. What does this do? Oh, this is the one where I return to the position. Oh, that, that's the, um, the Hasashin skill. What the fuck? Where are the mobs? This is so convoluted. I swear it wasn't this hard the first time I did this quest. Maybe because there's more people now? More people got keys. I think how this skill works. Yeah, it's like that. And then... Wait. How do I, how does that work? I thought it's like go back to my position. Hmm. Hold up. Do I like go back to him? Ah, I go back to him after running away. That's how it works. And it also stuns on hit. But that's like kind of the same skill as a Berserker has. Berserker has like almost the same skill. Like an engage. The only difference is that instead of um, being able to teleport behind them, you can just do it a second time and chase them down. So I'm not too sure how it's more yet, but we'll see. I also have this. That's like the thing that the guy did on me in PvP. Where I basically possessed him. It says. Yeah, it's literally... Well, actually it says penetrate. But yeah. Which is a really weird skill to be honest. Reaper looks fun. I I think if you like like high mobility role class is what they is what people recommend. Like if you're a 
mobility class, stealth class, etc. Assassin type player, they say Reaper is good. But of course, this is just PvE yet. I haven't really seen that this in action in PvP yet. Wait, this skill? Why don't this skill is just weird? Like, I guess you can attach yourself to someone and then they could just counter you by going back to their allies. So then as soon as you leave, you get ganked. It was just me, this and Spear Master or 5v5. You could, but this isn't. I don't think either of them are range classes, though. If we're looking for a range class, this might not be it. Pretty sure the um, alt spec for Reaper is actually a healer. Five v five is on large scale to you. Damn. But then why would you make two different classes for five v five? Hmm. Honestly, I'm doing. I feel like I'm either doing something wrong or something because I'm definitely like killing way slower than I am on my uh, berserker in PVE at least. I need tank. I haven't really seen tanks being useful up until now, at least. Actually, I don't think I've seen anyone play tank even. In fact, um, the fucking bars, the 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 healer, are like already tank enough by themselves, like. Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, the healer the healers are actually just tanks already. Like as soon as I get them down to like 20% HP, they just instantly heal back to full. I don't even know how you're supposed to kill that. Like, we had two or three people gank one bard, and they survive and kill back to full. I don't even know how that's possible, and people are saying the damage is too too high right now. Like, apparently the damage is going to be lower later on. So if that's true, then I don't- then bards seem to be immortal right now, so who knows. So why would you ever play a tank when you can be a healer and tank at the same time, you know what I mean? I think that's why usually in, in like competitive games, the healers can't heal themselves. And of course, that's like a staple in MMOs, you can always heal yourself in MMOs. Um, you don't consider healing mitigation? What does that mean, though? I mean, there's if you're only a tank, there's no reason for anyone to ever attack you. So what are you really tanking? Whereas if you're a healer, then people have to kill you first. So you basically draw aggro by supporting your allies. Which makes you more of a tank than real tanks. Because real tanks don't really draw aggro. The the play to against like actual tank builds is just ignore them. Whereas the play against healers is to actually target them.
Damage negation absorption. Depends on what abilities are on the tank. Tanks are supposed to be protect their sword healers, and squishies are not focused. But how would you protect a healer? More so than like just any class. Like by being a tank, you're not really doing a better job of protecting a healer any more so than like say just the DPS class. Like any, any DPS class can protect the healer. So there's really no benefit for you to be a tank just to protect the healer. Because that's something everyone can do. And everyone should be doing, in fact. Like if you're thinking Blade Master on PWI. Then yeah, Blade Master can protect the healer better than like a wizard. Sure. But Blade Master is more than just a tank. It's like a specific class that's designed to CC up to a group group support. It's more like a support class. Whereas tank would be like Barb. And Barb, I don't think they're really any better at protecting a cleric. Because barbs on PWI, they, they don't have aggro skills. In fact, the most threatening barbs on PWI are damage barbs anyways. If you're like a pure tank barb on PWI, everyone just ignores you. And you can only stun one person at a time. Because that's like that that's what a pure tank is. And in terms of damage negation, I mean, healing is negating damage. It just depends on your point of view, as Obi Kenobi, Obi Wan Kenobi would say. So, who knows? Anyway, I also have this skill. I'm not 100% sure. Like how to use this skill properly. But it basically lets me attack water while I'm invisible. So the translation, let's see. Activates the dust springer status, grants the invisible effect. Increases movement speed, increases damage. Lasts for 8 seconds. Wait, only 4 seconds of PvP. When your control is frozen, stun, levitate, or knock down, the invisible effect is lifted. Regenerates 1 incantation every 2 seconds. Increase the initial damage. Wait, increase the initial damage transformation rate of Light of Silence? What the fuck is Light of Silence? Huh? Wait, what's Light of Silence? Okay, I guess that's bad translation because I have no idea what Light of Silence is. To 25%, Hard Eater can immediately apply the maximum strength. Uh, so actually, this is like a semi alt. Almost. A mini alt. You just get all these buffs and you're invisible. I think, yeah, I think it look a bit better, but I still don't know what Light of uh, Silence is. Depends on the role. In League, tanks that have group AoE support and CC skills. Well, I would say if you have like multiple CCs, you're more of a CC support than a tank. And if you have high HP and defense and damage, that's 
That's called a broken class. So I don't know about that one. I don't think that's a tank thing. That's just that's being broken. Legendary repeated by SM1B the old player show his famous intuition on your Chinese spyware game. <laughs> Will he become the best Reaper in A? Bruh. Well, first of all, that's gonna depend if I'm like even gonna be playing this game as a Reaper, I guess. There's still uh, two other classes I wanted to try. I still wanted to see if um, Spell Sword and uh, Spear Master might be good or not. But I'm trying Reaper first because supposedly Reaper is like high mobility. And uh, high mobility is basically what I'm all about. So that sounds. Pretty much close to my playstyle, but at the same time, this class is also a heavy stealth abuser. I have two stealth. Actually, why is this a 232 second cooldown? I don't even get it. Wait, I actually don't get why this is a 232 second cooldown. Wait, all that does is an ambush skill. Yeah, 232 seconds, and that's just an ambush skill. Like, I, if I attack or move, or or anyone attacks me, yeah, it just um, instantly ends. That's just an ambush skill, and it's 232 seconds. That's so weird. I guess it's good because it has no limit. Like, you can be in stealth forever, as long as you don't move. Yeah, you can't move. You can't attack. Was this one. So I think this is just like, you're just supposed to camp somewhere, and then you just use this, and you wait for like someone to walk by, and then you um, gank them or something. I think that's what this is for. And then, whereas this is the combat stealth, because this is like the mini ult. Why is there no marksman class? Uh, I mean, spell sword is kind of a marksman class? I don't know. I mean, I guess if you literally need a bow or a gun for it to be considered a marksman class, then sure, there's no marksman class. But if like they're just looking for projectiles, then I don't know. I guess spell sword. Who knows? Spell sword is splendor. What? How is spell sword splendor? Oh, what am I supposed to do again? I forget how to do this quest. There's a ranger class. Um, yeah, I did hear there's more classes. Coming out, but I don't think any of the um, I don't think any of the classes are going to be out on release though. So that's not too helpful. Oh, in this game, just looks like Splendor. Maybe. That's why I do want to try it, though. But I also heard that apparently right now, Spell Sword is better to play as ranged than melee? I'm not 100% sure, though. And the ranged uh, Spell Sword looks a lot more like Butang than Splendor, to be honest. You literally set up like a field of sword. It will be hard for this game to make you quit Lost Ark. I mean, how can you quit a game that isn't even released yet?
that's why you you play this game until Lost Ark comes out. Lost Ark is released. I mean, debatable. If the game was released, then when it comes to NA, you're not going to reroll to NA, I'm assuming, because it's already released. Because that's what released means. No. Released means you don't have to reroll. If you have to reroll, then it's not released. So the question is, are you going to reroll if it comes to NA, you know? That, that's all it's about. It has nothing to do with identity. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> you're not going to reroll? Alright, well, I guess that's pretty unfortunate. I guess everyone else will just be uh, playing Lost Ark without you. You'll play on both? I guess you're just going to be uh, behind in gear then. Do every single daily quest twice. Do the daily dungeons twice. Etc. Etc. No. Then what? <laughs> you know, quit job and sleep only three hours of sleep per day. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All nine classes. Um. Yeah, but I, I, I don't think there's been any confirmation that all nine classes will be out though. Cause they, I think they pretty much said that the closed beta is gonna be what's gonna be in the release, unless I'm mistaken. So it'd be really weird for them to have only six classes in the closed beta and then bring out three classes just suddenly on release. That doesn't make sense. LXRD is key, yep. Oh yeah, he is uh IG. It's just how you say keys in Japanese. And actually, it's not LXRD, it's uh, Lord. It's LORD. So that was my bad. I hate how right now I'm at like doing this quest and they only give 2k exp per. But then later on the quest gives like 10k. So like right now I kind of feel like it's not worth it to do quest. Kind of feeling like I rather just do dungeons. But then I know that later on it's gonna be more worth it to do the quest than to do dungeons. I guess like level 20-ish is kind of just a slow slow sort of slow point. Maybe. I 
I actually don't know if I can like skip some of the quests if I do um, dungeons right now. Let's just go straight to the 10k ones. Or if that's not allowed. Because right now I don't think it's worth it at all to do, be doing these quests. Which are only giving like 3k each. Whereas I could do a dungeon for 10k. But earlier, at like level 20, I was getting so many quests that it was more worth to do quests than dungeons, so... I'm gonna need someone who actually spends the time to figure out to figure all this out, but by the time they do that, it's gonna be useless anyways. Because they're gonna have the um, new mechanic that makes it faster to level soon. Or at least hopefully soon. Uh, actually, I don't want to kill that zombie. There's literally no point. Fuck, so stop following me. Damn, what is the mob aggro range in this game? It's still after me. Damn, it's still after me. I guess I'm too used to BDO, where the mouse was just the aggro after like, I don't know, three seconds. I'm just completing an entire quest right here while this guy is chasing me. I wonder if it's going to chase me until the entire timer runs out. Okay, now it the aggro's. I guess if you put a debuff on it... It just chases you until the entire thing runs out. Uh, well, that would be good, to, useful to know if uh, grinding actually mattered in this game, but luckily it's just questing. Or maybe unluckily, depending on who you ask. See, now the quests are picking up. Just instantly got like 3 times 4,000. EXP quests. And this is a sticking. So I just have to walk around, grab some loot, and then that should be an instant 10k. So if I can just consistently get these type of quests all the time, then it'll be really fast. And also leech off people as much as possible. I don't think I got the kill. Maybe I walked too far away. Or maybe I didn't hit enough. I think I just didn't hit enough. Oh wait, never mind. That's why. You have to pick up these um, things that's strong. Yeah, that's kind of confusing. Like, I, I always miss that sometimes. Sometimes you have to, if you just kill them all, you get the draw. Sometimes you have to pick it up yourself after killing them. And they could never really figure out which one to switch. I'm pretty sure for this one. If I just walk away. Yeah, see, if I walk away, it, it instantly goes to my inventory as well. Even though it drops onto the ground first. But that's not a kill quest, but... There's a few kill ones like that as well. Wait. The rest of them are uphill. God damn it. Honestly, it might be slower for me to jump. 
into the sprint. So maybe I shouldn't be doing that. No, I wonder. They said they updated um the tutorial, right? The preliminary quest has not been completed and has therefore been automatically accepted for. Oh hey. They uh they fixed the uh, tutorial voiceover. The tutorial voiceover is in English now. That was one of your uh, major complaints, Dante. So there you go. They fixed the tutorial. You know how the tutorial was um, in Chinese? The voiceover for the tutorial? But it's English now. I don't know if you heard that. When the, when the person was talking. The girl. She was speaking English just now. So that's good. We can have Chinese voice acting an English tutorial. I think that's all the quests over here. I have to turn in. I'm still on level 25. I feel like I've been level 25 for the past uh, one and a half hour. They're quitting BDO for sure now. Well, there's multiple good games right now coming out soon, so no real reason to play BDO, I think. Unless you like just like BDO. But getting hearts from Chicago Lottery Box, I don't know if that is the straw that breaks the camel back. Maybe there's bigger problems than that. You know, I remember the days when getting hearts is better than getting memory fragments. So, I don't know. Back then, you would have counted yourself lucky. Jeez, you can buy my account. Heck W. PvP ready. Sure, but... Anyone is PvP ready. If you don't care about your KDA. Can kill most players. <laughs> Anyone can kill most players. If they don't care about going red. <laughs> Check the view. <laughs> Fuck, I wanted to get the sneak. I have to kill this guy, anyways. 248 AP can't kill most players? Yeah, they can. Most players are 400 gear score. No, I'm not. Bro, most players are 400 gear score. There was, there was a survey. 
or not a survey, they released the stats. There was a there was a stat thing that said most players have 400 gear score. That's only for people who like did seasonal though. And season server is actually like not something that most players have done. Because when we talk when we talk most players that's that's not true at all. Most players do not have 600 gear score. Um, it depends on how. I mean, I, unless you're just like changing the definition of playing the game. Exactly. People who quit are also a player. In fact, anyone who has an account is a player. Well, seasonal is three six hundred gear score, but that's now. And then now that they uh, canceled seasons, it's gonna go back down again. The average. Besides, 261 AP definitely can kill 600 gear score, man. It's 650 gear score that they can't kill. Because when you're 600 gear score, you still basically have, like, only 300. And 20 DP. Well, you're also more geared than most, most players, though. That's why 248 AP can't kill you. And I and also I said six, 261 AP. So. Yeah, and see, you're you're more geared than most players, and 261 could still kill you. Maybe I should finish the quest here first before I leave, actually. So what's the plan? Um, I think for the CBT2, there's some, there's a few new mechanics. So we have, we have factions for one. That's, that's something we need to check out. Uh, shit, I can't actually see. We have Garden of Blades. That's also new. We have... There was an open world PvP map, but I don't know where it is. Hmm, maybe it's here? No. It's somewhere. It's, yeah, it's somewhere. I don't know where though, there's an open world PvP map. I think that's also, that's also out. And then there's also open world faction PvP. So I think those are the four things. That we probably want to check out by the end of CBT1. 
And then also on top of that, um, if there's time, check out the uh, Spearmaster and Spell Sword. Yep. That's why I'm gonna be playing uh, solo all week. Especially since uh, Van, Van won't play the game, so I have to relay the information to him. <laughs> I'm playing solo solo. Unfortunate. Well, I was supposed to also PK with Sam and Sasu, though. But in order to even do that, you need to make a character first, of course. Uh, I guess I'll just stat this in. And that's the thing. I don't actually know how we're gonna get time to play. Probably during the weekend is what I'm assuming. Ooh. Alright, I got multiple. Looking for the companion. Max are out. Already cooled down. When fighting with you, it seems to be able to boil again. Wait. Hmm. Wait, why is the companion speaking in English though? That's weird. The NPC still speak in Chinese. Doesn't it? Or at least I'm hearing Chinese right now. And the cutscenes in Chinese. So why is the companion in English? That's really weird. Where's my settings? You don't think she's only has six hours? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Probably... Probably the weekend. But I don't know. I guess I'll have to figure it out later. 13 build on BDO. What should you get? I mean, you don't actually do open world PvP though, so that's kind of difficult. So if you actually did open world PvP, then like, I could just say, get a dream horse. But you don't do that. Dream horse isn't useless for open world. That's that's the whole point of why I said it. Dream horse is the best investment I made. Nope. There's no point having gear if you can't make it to the PvP in time before it ends. Nope. Open world PvP is like you have to be there within like three minutes or it ends. You would still AFK ride? Well, like I said, you don't do open world PvP. Because if you did open world PvP, AFK riding is just a no go. You're never going to make it to any PvP if you AFK ride for open world. You have to be there in three minutes, or else it ends. That's a very spur of the moment thing. <laughs> That's a manually writing PFK right in Intel's. What the fuck?
I guess, uh... You don't just do both at the same time. Don't have a second monitor where you could manual ride while watching stream. How do you grind? Now, most people who grind have a second monitor when they watch their movie while grinding. I thought that's how it worked. I haven't grinded in the months. Damn. I guess that's why you'd be hiding gear now. Why is my thing not working? Alright, now I just now I just wait here. Let the companion do all the work. Listen to music. Oh, that's always good. But I think the professionals, the way they do is they watch a movie while grinding. That's how they manage to go for 10 hours at a time. That's cringe. Is it really cringe though? If it lets them go for 10 hours? Well, I guess that's just the difference between a pro player and a casual player. What can I say, man? I don't hear you say that about the NBA playoffs. Now you could be playing solo instead of watching the NBA playoffs. The whole parents grinding 10 hours back to back. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's just like a full day work week, though, you know? Working from 9 to 5, that's like 8 hours. So it's just, it's just like 2 hours of overtime on top of that, you know? Besides, that's how you, uh... People who work for 10 hours... They work that long in order to have the money to feed their kids. Okay, it's kind of weird now. Like, some of the voiceovers are in English and some of them are in Chinese. That's, that's so weird. I don't like that at all. Why, why is it like that? What's going on? Like, right now, the companion is speaking Chinese, but the mobs are speaking English. The fucking frogs are speaking English. That's so weird. What is my thing set to, even? No, half of the NPCs are speaking Chinese, half are English. It's not just companion.
And in fact, they did translate the companion because when I feed the companion, she was speaking English. And right now, like she's speaking Chinese. Like that's that's just so weird. No, no. Like, it's just any random NPC. Like I talk to them. Sometimes they'll be in Chinese, and sometimes they'll be in English. Yeah, so, like some NPCs are translated, some aren't. So I don't get what's going on. Yeah, see, like, see, like, like the frogs right now are are definitely speaking English. The rest of the company is definitely speaking Chinese right now, and we'll we'll see after this. Let's see what happens. Let's see. I'm pretty sure the boss is going to be in Chinese. The fuck? Did I not dig that fully? What the hell? I could have sworn I finished digging that. The previous boss was in Chinese, that's for sure. The frogs are in English. Let's see what this boss is going to be. It's, it's a huge mystery. Yeah, that's in Chinese. <laughs> He couldn't even speak what? What was that word they said? to go well, two and after Lakers game. All right, see you later. I don't know how long that's gonna be though, so I don't know if I'll be streaming. I mean, technically I still have work, so can't stream all day. Two and a half hours, maybe it'll be on still. That's like no time at all. Even I have overtime? Wait, what do you mean? I'm talking about work for tomorrow. I'm already off work. That's not overtime, that's just regular work hours. No, I have to sleep. Damn. Anthony's the one who doesn't sleep down in here. Sleep is a myth for you. <laughs> Just because I sleep at different times doesn't mean I don't sleep. It's just that, for me, I sleep right before the sunrise. That's the difference. Instead of after the sun sets. <laughs> oh, I guess I got a new skill. What does this do? Oh, wait. Eliminates crowd control. So this is my CC removal. Same to nine AM. Well, that's only that's only three hours. Nah, that's too short. Would have to be at least five to nine at minimum. If I have a nine AM meeting. Where am I going? Hold on, where am I going? What the fuck? It's down here. 
Residual Rancor. So, I have a CC break too. But my, this class is only once every 60 seconds. Whereas my Berserker can do it twice. Huh. Interesting. So everyone has the CC break. But different classes have it differently. Hmm. They're all CC breaks, but not exactly the same. Imagine how a solid 8 hours of sleep would be better sin than C Flash X. I don't know what to say about that one. It's debatable if that's really correlated. Fuck, I keep going to the wrong place. Bro, I, I waste way too much time going to the wrong place. Like... Every time I go to the wrong place, I waste like at least 10 seconds. This is not going well for my speedrun. Wonder if I get lost easily in real life? Uh, it's a good question. I mean, I don't really travel without the GPS these days, you know? So. Who knows, if I didn't have a GPS, what would happen? But we always have a GPS. So. It's all good. What, what do you mean? What's the difference between solving the problem and stopping? How can I get lost if I follow the GPS the entire time there? That means I never have a chance to get lost in the first place, because I'll be following the GPS. Yeah, I use my GPS at the start of every journey. Exactly. <laughs> what do you mean, what the fuck? What? That's not weird. What's wrong with that? Wait, I don't get it. What, what, why did I not complete this quest? It says to go here, right? What the fuck? That was a that was a that was so weird. Damn, you start without GPS. <laughs> Damn. See, if you were like me, then you would never get lost. Be twice as efficient that way, you know. After all, they have GPS integrated into the car. So using GPS is as simple as driving. Damn, you go to the city first and then you near the suburb and then you use the GPS. That's so that's so old fashioned. That's like back in the days. Where you would uh, go to the place and then pull out all the map from your pocket. Damn. Not a bad thing though, I guess. If you traveled a lot back in the days. 
I know, right? What can I say? What can you say? Um, that, see, that's right there. It's like a random AKE XP quest. That's what I need. Oh, wait, I don't need to do this because I don't care about this thing. That does nothing for me. I just want to ignore that. And then... Wait, where the fuck is this quest? Is it here? It's here, right? Oh, it was on the on my screen. See, for some reason, it wasn't marking out on my map, which is what I was looking at. We're going to kill two? Oh, no, wait, there are two different ones. I definitely feel like I take more damage as well. See, the thing is, I don't think I have any CCs. At least I haven't really noticed any CCs. Like, this is an interrupt. That's it. Like, these are invisible, but it's not CCs. This is like, this makes me immune to damage, but it's not a CC. This is a DOT, this is damage. This is like my only CC right now. Whereas some Berserker, like at this point, I already have like three CCs at this level. So I'm actually not sure if this is just like a pure DPS class. Because if it is, it might not really be my style. Because I like movement, but I also like outplaying people. And you're not really outplaying people if you can't CC them. Time to reroll? Well, I'm only level 26. You know, I, I fill up every slot, right? Like, I fill up... Like... Four more slots here, and then probably like four more slots here. At least I'm Berserker. I don't know about this class. So I, I, I'm still missing like eight skills, I think. So it's way too early to say for sure. Eight. At least for Berserker. I don't know. I don't know if Reaper's the same. But Berserker, I had like eight. Eight more skills than this. Almost, yeah. So I'm taking so much damage because I can't CC any of them. I, mean, I guess I can just recover, kind of. Actually, no, that doesn't even recover my HP. It's just an immunity. So I don't actually know if that's really that useful. Honestly, this feels like more like a support skill in PvP. Than like the damage or even a combat skill, so I don't know. I don't know, like under what situations might I need to wait out something? I guess it could be useful if, like, to, like, block one skill, I guess. Like, I, I, I use this to avoid their one DPS skill, wait it out. Could be useful that way. Damn, why is the PvE so hard right now? Why are these things so tanky? What the fuck is going on? Six. Seven. You know what? I also, I remember, when I was doing this on my Berserker, I had, um... 
I have full purple gear for, from dungeons. That could be part of the reason. But it also might not be. So we'll see. So, these five cages. What else do I have? I guess I didn't learn my lesson. <laughs> the lady. <laughs> I mean, ultimately, I'm getting paid no matter what happens, so. It's not my problem. Wait, that guy was speaking English. And then this guy's speaking Chinese. Like, it's just so random. What's going on? This guy's not speaking at all. What? Who was washing their hands? That's what I just remember. I'm supposed to do the wash my hand thing. Or like a free... Free mount or something. Except it's not here. No, it's here. Wait, no, it's not. What the fuck? I just got trolled by the AI, I think. I heard him say something about washing hands. The bandits were English. They stole Chinese wives. What? <laughs> They're nice, the ladies? What? Does that. Would that actually even work? Like. Like, how would they understand each other? If they had never spoken each other's language before. Damn, the old-fashioned way, I guess. <laughs> Damn. That's like the caveman way. What the fuck is that effect? It's so, that's so fucking weird. That screen blur. And I don't know what causes it. But it only happens here. In this area. Damn, are you saying miners? Are cavemen? I... I guess? <laughs> I guess... I guess that could make sense. It's <laughs> all their lives working babes. Damn. Are mines caves? I guess they are. I guess caves don't have to be naturally formed. That is good meme.
Read the notes left behind by the deceased. Where is that? It's right here. Damn, I literally walked around in a circle for no reason. It's just wasting time again. I don't even know what this quest gives, like the world quests. It doesn't even say. Um Alright, that's 7k. We I see see that was English, I'm pretty sure. Wait, what the fuck? Hold on, hold on. We envoys of the turquoise lantern. Okay, what is going on? But when some of our people have to communicate with the living, they become very What is going on? If we say the wrong thing, please forgive us, Dr. Her. Like 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 the guy is talking to her in Chinese and he's replying back in English. Ah, so we Like what is actually going on with this? Bilingual society now. I mean, Canada's a bilingual society technically, but I still don't think people Wait, let me see your face. like speak one language and reply in another. Isn't that just weird for you to talk to someone in one language and then they reply back in another? I guess if they don't really. Well, I guess there's some people who can understand when spoken to, but can't speak back. I, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> but still, I, I, I don't know. I guess that's like Neo. Actually, I don't know if Neo can uh, listen to Chinese though. Hmm. So actually, I don't think I know what Neo like that. That's. Guess it's all in the movies that I've seen that happen. So we just got six four quests right away. See, so yeah, it's helpful when the quests are grouped together. Uh, beauty tips. That's probably not related, right? I'm guessing I don't have to go there. If it turns out beauty tips are related to spider eggs, then the knights just got memed. But I'm going to assume there's it's not related, so I can just continue my quest here. And then go back there once I'm done here. Why are we... Are we just using a hammer? Huh. I didn't know you use hammers to kill spider eggs, but I guess that makes sense when spiders are this size. And I guess and hammers are good with to crack eggs after all, so I guess it all it all works out. I think when spiders have everything in size, the appropriate weapon is more like a rocket launcher. <laughs> Damn. 
Yeah, especially if they're Australian spiders. But I think most of the spiders in my house are harmless, at least. Wait, what? Did we just take the clothes off, off this dead guy? I wasn't paying attention, but... Pretty sure I took... It said clothing, and I took it. And it was actually a corpse. So I just still close off a dead guy. That's maxed out evil T. Damn. I feel like my main has more respect now because I only kill people who are alive. I don't kill people who are dead. So maybe that's actually better. You know? It's more respectful for the dead. everything here. Oh no, wait, there's a few plants I need to, or wait, that's just a point. Not even a plant. I'm just looking at a rock. Yes. Damn. Danger and beauty. We're back to this place. Level 27. Headless corpse. Yeah, see? I guess here we're just brushing their clothes with flower juice, at least. Okay, that's just s such WTF. Like that that voice acting though. I, I don't know if you heard the voice acting. Tinker <laughs> did a good job. Damn. They can't even hire voice actors. Hire using interns for their voice actor, I guess. Or maybe it's an intern voice actor. I mean, voice actors are artists, right? So, pretty can get some for exposure. Is this using the current staff? And then we need to, they're like, we need to translate the game to English. Give the intern some line. Damn, not even, not even hiring voice actors for exposure. It's just going straight for the intern route. I don't know though. I feel like exposure is a pretty tried and true strategy though. Maybe they should try some of that. It's the intern beatboxing. Wait, what? Wait, which shooting game was the intern beatboxing? 
Are you talking about the um the un totally realistic battleground battlefield? The Steam game that I was playing, the Battle Royale. Yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, I think that's actually an indie game, though. So I think it might actually be that one person who made it. Or maybe it started as an indie game. I don't know if it still is. But yeah, it might actually be the developer who was doing it. But honestly, it was pretty good, though. Yes. It's supposed to imitate real life. That's how people do it in real life. It's totally accurate, after all. Alright, what else are what else am I still missing? Damn, I wanted to get past this mountain by walking, but Ah, oh, looks like I'm gonna have to fly. Fuck. And I crashed into it. Yeah, that's another minus 10 seconds off my speed run. What's this guy AFK? Fuck, he just healed. Bro, even the fucking bombs are bards. Now what else am I doing here? Up here, I think? Yeah, up here, I think. Was I supposed to do something? I feel like I was supposed to do something here first. See, sometimes they throw in a trick question. Or you have to read the quest to know what's going on. But maybe this isn't that one of them. I think this one I just kill. Sometimes you have to press an item. Before killing them, or else it doesn't work. Except this guy saw yellow.
damn, this guy's doing so much more damage than me. Almost died to a mob. I don't know why I'm not doing damage. Like, this is my only good skill. Like, I don't know if it's just because DOTs are bad versus mobs, as always, in every game, or what. Like, this is kind of a DOT class, I guess. And DOTs are bad in PvE, usually, so I don't know if that's the reason or not. Okay, so I need to ignore this. Because that's not going to give me EXP. Oh, wait, I need to kill this. Like, all I'm doing is this, and but that does so little damage. But maybe this is a hard class, and I don't really get it yet. Okay, so we still need to do um, two over here. Start factoring time value of damage. Well, I, it's not just like this game. In every MMO, usually DOT is bad for grinding, I think. Dude, what is this DOT damage that he's taking right now? It's like what? I mean, he's taking like between 100 to 1k sometimes? Like, how much is he taking right now? 282, 125. 125. I mean, it's like. I don't know why sometimes he takes 1k though. Wait, how does that even work? Each stack increases by 25%. If it's first time, it's stacked to the maximum. If it's not infected, there's a 50% chance of adding two stacks. Wait, what? Upper limit three stacks. For NPC, each stack increases by 25%. If NPC is hit for the first time, it's, it's stacked to the maximum. What? That doesn't explain anything. 1,000 damage in 10 seconds is only worth 2,200 damage today. If they just bump the ratio, then one. If it's 10,000 damage in 10 seconds, which is 200 damage today, then dots would be OP. Like what? I'm talking about PWI? Because this game basically just released in an A, so. I don't think there's been any um, inflation yet for that to be a problem. Just <laughs> go. It's just time about changing the number. It's because the number is too low. Um. Hmm. Please, please don't. I'll give you what you want. It could be. I'll ask my father now. Talk to me. But I think usually, it's because um in PvP. Usually the DOT kind of have like specific mechanic that kind of like the way they calculate it is better when against players when players have high defense and low HP versus mobs that have a uh, low uh, high HP but low defense or something like that. At least in mode in the games I played. I don't know about this game though. The mobs don't actually have that high HP. Or do they? 
Like, it's about the same HP as what I have. Actually, no, this is like 6k. This is like 4.7. Yeah, so no, it's like almost the same HP as what I have, so I, I don't really know. Yeah, it does. So I'm pretty much just spamming this skill. And I don't know if that's really the way to go. I'm not 100% sure if I'm playing it correctly. But that's what it seems like. Quest called Over My Dead Body. Good pun. Not sure if uh, it's appropriate though, since someone died, but maybe maybe it is. From the, according to the story, at least. How is it a pun? Cause some guys, cause like this whole place is about dead people. Like I'm pretty sure this whole village is just like haunted by spirits or something. And in fact, this is where you would go for, to the spirit realm. Like this village is the spirit realm place where you get the spirit realm uh, bounty hunter, whatever thing. Um, what else do we have to do? I hate how these world quests keep showing up. Just adds to the confusion. So not only do you have to uh, do your quest fast, but find the correct place to go very quickly and not get lost, but you also have to know which ones you need to ignore. Because apparently I accidentally did three dead bodies earlier and that was not needed at all. Damn, I can't take this on. Fuck. I guess those two are in the party and I can't take their buff. When do I get the Soul Lantern? I think around now, but I don't know if I really want to get it again. Because we didn't really get anything last time. At least I don't recall. Like, what do we really get from it? Fuck, where is it? I, for I forget where it was. Melodies of the Legends? No, uh, no. Not Book of Aeons. Oh, Ancestral Record, yeah. Yeah, like last time I was doing this. But the... But the XP wasn't good. I'll go there again take a look. After this, I think. But I do remember the XP was pretty bad. Back to killing pandas. Yep. What the fuck? They knocked me down. I still don't really get knockdowns. Like, none of the skills really say that it knocks down. But sometimes, just as I attack, they just knock down. So that, I'm still trying to figure out how that really works. Damn, you can have Chinese names still. I wonder if I should like use a Chinese name in the in, in the uh, release. I mean, no one will be able to message me, but maybe that's actually uh, part of the good meme, so no one can trash talk.
You can press on someone and message them. Oh, you could. Damn. Help me spam. Damn. But, like, it's still the same, um... It's the same characters, though. So, how do they no not know if I already supported it or not? Okay, yeah, this is the quest where I exercise the spirits. Jowli's surname was Yin. She comes from a family of scholars. As time passed, the you seen the lander. Did storied wealth and glory, and she was forced to work in a brothel. Go to the every second NPC. You don't think it's just RNG? All right, but which one will be the second RNG? This is the first NPC. This is the second NPC. Damn, that's the first and that's the second. <gasps> Damn, this is the first. This is the second. Damn, what is going on? <laughs> this is the first. This is the second. Where's my lander? Damn. This is what Damn. Every, it was the second NPC every time. What the fuck? Damn, you're cheating. How did you know that? I mean, I unlocked the biography, but at what cost? Uh... Really? It was always the sec oh, second NPC in the first playthrough? I thought it was this RNG. Damn. I guess you're the pro speedrunner here. Saving time by going to the second NPC only. Shaping like 50% off the time from that quest. Then where are you going to become a speedrunner, Anthony? Solo speedrunner. Or just speedrun anything. Alright, here's my new skill. Uh, Maggot Awakening. Maggot Awakening, alright. What a name. Wait, what even is Moth Poison? H Heart Eater and Moth Poison deal damage. There's a 30% and 20% true gen, like 20 points of edge. What the fuck is moth poison? What? what? Did I learn that? What the heck? Oh. Damn, your class puts maggot in the enemies, then awaken them, then the maggot spirit to the skin and starts eating the heart. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, that's what happens when you use a scythe, I guess. Uh, yes, this is, see, 
That's what it is. So you can choose. So if you use the first one, it lets Hardy there stack four times. Whereas if you use the second one, it, the duration of Hearth Eater is extended, and it cannot be dispelled. And then when War Moon hits a target that has three Heart Eater, it receives one stack of more Moth Poison. So that's how it works. So you have to get this passive for the Moth Poison to work. But I guess that's still better. Huh. Or I can pick a skill, actually. I can actually pick a skill that reduces damage taken by 25%. And then I create a doppelganger that moves towards the target and explodes and gives them a heart eater when it explodes. <laughs> the scientists used to harvest crop and they're like the infected with Machinix. <laughs> uh, I mean, if your weapon is a scythe, then you have to resort to these type of tactics. What kind of skill even is this? I'm gonna try this on something. Where's my next quest? Uh, I have to use the Underworld Lantern. See, I don't I don't think this is worth it, though. Like, this is only 1k EXP. I think I'd rather just do this, right? River Bamboo. Bro, this show location is useless. Oh, wait, is this feed right here? Bath has refreshed me so much. Damn, and the pet. Pet, as they say, is in English. Wait, what's going on? S since I get 1k by visiting, I don't do anything else. Leave and do it? Is that all that's needed? Don't I, I, I thought I had to do something last time. But let's see. Okay, I guess I have to talk to this guy and that's it. Oh no, wait, do I? Yama and the Shadow. Oh, oh right. I had there was like this mob I had to kill last time. But it only gave me 1k. Can I leech? Is he almost dead? Should I leech? I think I can leech. There's like four or five people killing it. Yeah, it's just, just leech. He's almost dead. Alright, I guess that was good. Oh, but I have to go back and collect. Receive the collectible. Oh, the blue noted lotus currency. Maybe I should check out the shop sometime, but that's a PvE thing, so I don't really care about that right now. Oh, do I leave again? Oh, there we go. Well, check out PvE stuff once the game actually releases. Right now, it's just PvP. <laughs> Um. Oh, but there was this thing. Right, that's what I was trying to do last time. If I get the Turquoise Lantern Cultivation Quest, then I get 6k, but I couldn't figure out how. Yeah, because when I click there, it says I haven't completed the tutorial. But then when I go here, it's like... It's like, what, it's like what, what am I even looking at? I don't even know. Yeah, that's that's what I couldn't figure out last time.
But I guess, uh... We'll not worry about that. This time. So we can save some time. By just doing quests that we already know how to do. Um, what else was there? There was also... Okay, that's useless. But I can't open any of these. Bro. Upgrade this. Open this. Um, okay, that did not do anything for me. Okay, that did not do anything for me. Uh, how about this? Okay, that did not do anything for me. Alright, never mind. Oh, wait, no, there's some stuff, whatever. Consumables. Collectibles. Crafting materials. Alright. I guess it's fine. It said an old book with illegible handwriting. Wait, where did it say that? It was really illegible. How did the book words appear in the book? I mean, someone wrote the book and then it became uh, illegible over time, right? I'm assuming that's what they meant. I closed it too quick, but you saw it. How did you see it? Damn, you're really uh, going back in time just to read what it wrote, what it said. Damn, I guess you're a fast reader. Um, but underneath it was the book. Damn. That's the type of talent you need to become a pro speedrunner. Like I said. Alright, where am I supposed to go again? I'm supposed to go like here. I got confused because of all the world quest that suddenly appeared. Alright. No, this is the world quest again. What am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to. All right, there was there's a thing here. Waiting for him to spawn. All right. I guess I can try this. What does this do? Damn. What the heck? Oh, let me kill the guy. Kill this first. Yeah, open coffin, because there's spirits now, and crawled out of the coffin. Spirit will float out of the coffin? Not in China. In China, sometimes they can interact with the real world. You know? Or maybe once the spirit leaves the corpse, the corpse becomes a zombie. I don't know. I don't know how it really works. Not too much of an expert. Never really seen any of this in real life, you know. Wei Hua Heart.
Wait, is it? No, it's way, way quite hard. Which means... I mean, yeah, I don't really know, because there's no accent. There's no accent on these words, so it's hard to know what it's saying. Wait, why are we back to killing spiders? I already killed spiders. It was a person's name? It could be. But I didn't see an apostrophe S. Or did or was there an apostrophe S? These are poisonous spiders. Actually, this skill's kind of shit. Now that I think about it. Like, what is it even doing, really? I guess it's poisoning it every so often. Eh. Yeah, the giant spider is guarding the poisonous spider. Like, I wonder if they're the same species, though. Wouldn't they be like two different species? What incentive is for the giant spider species to guard the poisonous spider egg? If they're not. Hmm. Right, what else am I supposed to do? Elixir for crafting? I think we're done here. Yeah, we're done here. Does this get mistaken? It's like the situation you put duck egg under the head? Really? Damn, I didn't know that. Damn, I did not know that was a thing. I guess it makes sense, right? Because <clears throat> in movies, there's always like plot point where the like the a big bird mistakes the protagonist as one of their children or something like that. Romans not nothing on Chinese. Wait, what does that mean? Wait, what the fuck? Duh. His name is just Duh. And then here his name is Chinese. And here his name is Chinese ass. And here it's back to Chinese. And now it's in English. I, I, don't, I don't get how it's even possible for this to be like messed up like that though. Like, they should all be referencing the same string. Like, how do you have it translated in one place, not translated in another place, and half translated somewhere else? Like, I don't even get how that's possible from, from a programming standpoint. Damn, Roman's got nothing on Chinese. Damn. The developer is so self-taught, so they don't have any best practice knowledge. That's pretty oof. Alright, we're going to the foothills now. I mean, I 
guess this game is made in Unity. So it's not like a proprietary engine. So technically, they do not need as much knowledge, I guess. But still, Unity itself is still pretty complicated. I don't think it's that simple to just get into it. Wait, actually no, it's in Unreal, not Unity. Did I say Unity? Um, but but yeah, because Un Unreal is in C++. And C++ is generally not the beginner's language. What is going on? Up there. Ignites 99 Sea Dragon leaping over the Golden Waves firework for show. We wish her more and more Astro Essence, many PvP victories, and lots of luck for and money. Her name is in every golden fishing hole on the continent. What is going on? Is this is some like e dating mechanic? I guess it's like PWI where you can like, like I don't have PWI. They they added like these uh, things where you can use the firework on someone and then like as a no, this one is system message. <sighs> There's a problem. But, and that was entirely for e dating, I think. For those of us, I have no idea what that was about. Cause that was like a huge system message up there. At the top. God damn, we're not even at the at the park where we go into the uh, five elements yet. That's like at least another hour away. And yet somehow it's still gonna be faster to get there, like this than it is to actually um, get out of jail. Actually, there was one thing I should have tried. Whether or not I can use the jail debuff to queue into a uh, PvP arena. I never tried that or not. Because if you could, then I don't really need to get debuff off. I just need to go into arena and just meditate every so often, I suppose. But I guess I would need it for faction battle. So that's always unfortunate. How many times have I told you not to call me that? Why do you keep forgetting? He, he just switches from English to Chinese in between, like his lines. The elders had their hands full. They even dispatched Yan Ning to kill demons, even though she's This is more bugged than, than CBT1 somehow. Sounds like the thing of which not end up like <laughs> that's in the first place. But how's I I mean just don't don't RPK. That's, that's the answer. Don't RPK. But what's the point? You're not going to be able to kill anyone else e anyways. Like, who the fuck are you killing with 50% damage? Or actually, no, 30% damage. Like, you're not, you're not killing shit with 30% damage. Bro, why is this... What is going on? These mobs are actually so hard to kill. Oh, 
Uh, nope. That's the negative karma debuff. Why is it so hard to kill mobs in this class? I did not have this much problem on Berserker. No, but I didn't have this much problem on Berserker. What's going on? This is level 35 weapon. Or not level, quality 35. So that's like, that's better than quest gear right now. What the heck is going on? Wait, how did I do 1.5k earlier? But now I'm down to like no damage. Maybe Game Boss sends your ancestors have full negative karma. Now punishing the descendant. What the fuck? What kind of meme is this? That's some advanced meme. Pretty sure because of my passive, if War Moon hits a target when Heart Eater is active, I do more damage. Yes. And then if my Wheel of Frost, once damage has been dealt, it increases the War Moon damage even further. So the ideal gameplay is single target, actually. I do this, and then I do this, and then that's like supposed to be the most possible damage. But that's like, and that's still only 1k. It's like the most possible damage, it's still only 1k. At least it's more damage. So this. So right now, it's not good at AoE at all. Because Heart Eater is only good for single target, I'm pretty sure. So it's really bad for AoE right now. So in fact, what I need to do is like... I need to AoE Heart Eater or something. But I don't think that's a real thing. I think that's what this is for, right? No, wait, that's single target too. Hmm. I don't really have a way to AoE hard either. You know, this is, you know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of like Stormbringer. You know, you know how Stormbringer on PWI, you can stack that one skill up to six times. Or something, and then you consume all of it and it does more damage. It's kind of like that, I think. I'm like supposed to stack hard either and we will frost together. And then I burst them down with War Moon. But then I don't really get it. Because if I use Will of Frost immediately, it does no damage, because the Wheel of Frost, the more damage, like the more times I hit my target, the more damage Wheel of Frost does. Whereas with this passive, it's actually encouraging me to use it right away, so I can do more damage with War Moon. 
So I guess that's a different playstyle. Because I could do like... I could do like this, and then all it does is increase the damage of uh, Light of Silence, whatever, whatever that is. Light of Silence. Uh, what? I don't even see Light of Silence. Okay, and then this one would be like... If I use this, Wheel of Frost, it reduces the cooldown of Heart Eater. So this is more like a DOT, because it also reduces their healing. So actually, this is like anti-Bard, maybe. Because it reduces their healing. But only for 6 seconds, though. So maybe it's not that good. So I don't know if I'm fully understanding this correctly. Because I always thought you were supposed to stack up a few stacks of hits so you can execute them with Wheel of Frost. But, we, but it's like, I should use it right away, I feel like. I don't know if I'm playing that correctly necessarily. Uh, I'm gonna be right back. Give me one sec.
All right, I'm back. Unmute it? Yeah, I'm unmute it. All right. So, where are we at? Yeah, I guess I'll just solo this guy. I also don't have a way to like get edge fast. Because I need three edge, or not edge, um, incantations. I need three incantations per war move. And then I can use my R and B to get edge to get incantation fast, but that consumes edge. I have to L and B to get edge, but L and B is the slowest. So, hmm. Um, all right. What am I doing here again? Damn. Are, are we still not at the quest where I go to the dragon yet? Wait, when did I do this quest? I don't even remember doing this quest. Why do I not remember? Oh wait, no, I remember doing this quest. I just don't remember doing that specific step. So now it's dispersed down. I surely be using War Moon only every time I get three edge only. And then he got knocked down. I don't even know how he knocked him down. Or three incantations. So I can really like be managing both my edge and my incantations. But maybe that should just come naturally. I shouldn't be really I shouldn't really have to stare at it. I'm actually good at the class. See, he's knocked down again. Because you can hear, like, the sound, right? Like, you can hear the... Like, this, uh, explosion sound or whatever it is every time he gets knocked down. So I feel like that's part of the mechanic. Oh, he wants to take a breather, so he explodes? All right. <laughs> After standing all day. All right, let, let, let's go with that. Can't figure out the mechanic. Let's go with that explanation. Where was I supposed to go again? Fuck. That's stuck on the pillar. These must be some really valuable flowers. <laughs> Aren't there flowers that are like super rare and can only be found like in certain exotic locations? Or am I just imagining that? Is that a real thing? Damn. You said that, or there's this rich. If you're rich, then your flowers are symbolic of your family. So someone stealing your flowers is akin to them stealing your family symbol, I suppose.
Maybe not nowadays, but I guess back in the days, you know, it's it's your family symbol, so you can't let them steal it. <laughs> Game of Thrones housed. Well, I mean, it's it's how it worked back in the days, when especially when you're rich. Actually, don't like rich family nowadays have family emblems still, or, or is that not a thing anymore? I think that's still a thing, right? Even nowadays. Too much. Our little Damn. Damn. Not rich enough to have a personal emblem for your family. Imagine. What is this? Switches to the status Spectral Phantom and produces the effect Dustbringer. Wait, why is all with a completely different description? Wait, if I hold down Alt, that description is so much better for some reason. Greens a figure which stores her current status for 20 seconds. During its existence, you can press the key again to restore the status saved, including position, edge, incantation, and cooldown, and regain half the damage you take in this period. Oh yeah, this is the OP skill. This is the back in time skill. What is your family in <laughs> since I live in a mansion? What? No, I don't. What are you talking about? See, if I knew, I wouldn't have had to ask. Let's see how this skill works. Like... Uh, well, none of these are kill quests right now, so... Um... Damn, we need to get you a kill quest. But all of these are fetch quests. So I don't know if it's a good or bad thing, but... When there's a fetch quest, they're all fetch quests. When there's a kill quest, they're all kill quests. I should stomp jump him. Pretty sure that's slower. It just feels nice to jump though. These are all still fetch quests. Oh, well, eliminate the wild fox. I guess I'll do that after I talk to these guys here. Yeah, jumping makes your character slower in this game. I'm pretty sure it does. I looked after her and gave her things to eat. I never imagined she would be so ungrateful. Which is weird. Doesn't jumping make you faster in real life, or is that not the thing? Maybe that's not the thing. I think it's... I think it's because you're like... Technically flying. <laughs> Maybe in PWI, not in real life. Nah. But in some games, you do go faster when you jump. But I thought when you like run super fast in real life, you kind of uh your both speed kind of leaps the air. Which makes you faster. I don't know, I'm not a sprinter, so Neil tested that on PWI? I do not remember that at all. 
Wait, what the fuck? I just left by accident. Oh my god. How did that even happen? I literally walked it for like two like two centimeters and I left. If you can jump without cost, then it might be faster. Damn. We don't stand a chance against Wang Chi, but you came all by yourself, so we won't make a fuss. All right, let's see what happens. So I use this. Wait, I'm also invisible when I do this. And then I go back, and it resets again. Damn. Strange underground storage. Well. The strange part is that, you know, there's monsters. I think I think that's the strange part. It's not the rice. That's strange. That's that's how I interpret it, you know. What the fuck? Why am I getting wrecked? Bro, these things are actually OP. What the fuck? Bro, that's actually OP. I, this class is so single target. I don't think I can even, like, AoE three mobs at a time. It's just three mobs. It's just kill me. It's just three mobs kill me. This is, like, full single target. This is, um... This is like playing Assassin on Perfect World without APS. Like, leveling up from, like, level 1, playing Assassin on Perfect World. With, like, starter gears and everything. It's like when Type 1 first released on Perfect World. This is what it feels like. You just target one mob at a time. Yeah, but then since you're light armor, every mob you attack, like, takes off half your HP. Unlike Archer, where at least you can do with the uh, knockback arrow and survive. Yeah, but... Like Archer and Wizard, you, you didn't really take damage because you just have the um, you just have the uh, what they call it, like the rotation, where you do st stunning arrow, followed by two auto attacks, followed by knockback arrow, followed by more auto attacks, and then they and then the mob dies, and you never took damage. Whereas Assassin. You just like go in and go ahead and melee, because if you're a blade master, sure you take damage, but you had heavy armor. And but assassin, you just take the full blunt of the damage, and you're just dying after every mob. This is basically that. Bleed spell, sleep, freeze, and run away. Well, eventually I moved to the freeze tactic where I freeze the mob and then I shadow jump to it and then it can't attack me. 
because I'm too close to it. I, I, I'm within its minimum. I'm under its minimum attack range. So that was the attack that I eventually went, re resulted in uh, reverted to using. But those, it was still pretty painful those first few times. Damn, see, see, that spirit is talking about not killing anyone, but he literally just killed me. What's that about? Might be a foreign concept in ancient times due to honor system. But there's a mechanic online? What? <laughs> what is this meme? <gasps> okay. <laughs> Shall I show you? Because you tied Asian. Still, you know, there's no reason for him to lie, I guess. So who knows? Chase doesn't have reason to lie half the time, but still does it. Damn. I guess you're really gonna trust Chase like that when he's away. <laughs> but his new video is pretty mean though. There's always that. Damn. I guess so. Got it. More like stream compilation. Actually, how would I tell the difference between using like this skill and and just normal like the my four invisibility? Like I'm both stealth, right? So like someone else looking at me can't actually tell. Oh wait, but I go out of invisibility eventually. Hmm. So actually, if I'm about to die, I just use this and I go back. And then I can regain my HP. And then finish them off. I guess that helps me AoE a bit. Well, see, it's not the stealth in this game. It isn't like PWI stealth. You can still see an outline of people who are stealth. So that's how the mobs are able to track me in stealth. Nobody takes my food away. 
yeah, like StarCraft stealth, but even better because this game, like you can target, like you don't need a target. Whereas in StarCraft, you still need a target. This is like StarCraft stealth, but you don't need a detector. Yeah, it's just visual stealth. So it's not that broken. But if they're not paying attention, you could definitely get them with it. And that's why when you stealth, you also have all these buffs. So it's more like... So like the buffs are really the main thing. The stealth is just like a s nice to have, I guess. If I just cover my eyes, I can't see anything. They can't see me. What the fuck? But I mean, like, you know, if you're stealth, and then, like, I guess. I guess, like, I go into stealth, and, like, I instantly, like, move away here. It will be pretty hard for them to see me. And even if they see me, I can, like, teleport back. So I guess, I guess if, like, that happens, it will be pretty hard for them to, like, track me, you know? You know? So, so maybe, maybe it makes sense after all, if you think about it. Made to roleplay tag? Well, it's just the high mobility class. I mean, there's lots of high mobility classes. Like, isn't Archer with Holy Path on Perfect World also like that? Made to roleplay tag. So, I don't know. Just the high mobility class, you know? I mean, visual stealth, actual stealth. If you're playing a shooter, they're all pretty good, strong, you know. But this game isn't a shooter, so that's why the class is balanced, perhaps. Of course, if it was a shooter, it would be overpowered. Also, I can always hide in the bush, you know, and then use this, you know, now that I'm in the bush, it will be even harder for them to see me. Wait, this only has a 30 second limit. I thought it was unlimited. So this is actually like really bad. 237 second cooldown was a three sec, a 30 second duration and you can't move. Or attack while using this, so like, what? This is like the worst skill. What is the point? Overwatch had a stealth character and it wasn't OP. That's probably because it like didn't have. It had like less damage than DPS characters, didn't it? I thought that was the balance. I don't I didn't play Overwatch. Didn't it? I thought that's how it worked. Or maybe I'm wrong. Sombra, I think? Yeah, Sombra. But I thought, like, 
I thought like that's kind of how it worked. Like it didn't have any um like burst damage skill, and its ulti didn't do damage either. I thought that I thought like that was the balance, I, but I don't know. Against Master Chong Yu's orders. I was worried, so I followed her. When we reached the entrance to the cave, we suddenly found ourselves surrounded by Huan Chi's monsters. Not only did they kidnap the sister, they were going to keep me as their slave. <coughs> I'm still a Heaven's Children student. I shouldn't let myself be humiliated like this. Just when I was about to risk my life, the sister said her life wouldn't be worth living if I died. When Huang Chi heard this, yeah, it's just an anti shield. Then he ordered them to let me go. Yeah, but it wasn't like I don't know solo Q, uh, solo uh, kill, like solo team wipe or whatever, you know. So like you're not like wiping an entire team from stealth. They tricked me again. Sometimes you have to you use the item instead of just going to the place. God damn it. Well, I don't know. That that's just what I understood. Like I don't I don't play the game, so. Fifty percent of the budget on cutscene and voice acting, but most people just spam okay next. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, I don't know. Maybe like most people would actually watch it though. I feel like I am not really most people, you know. So maybe this isn't really the best representation. Of what most people would do. Well, Twizzy also isn't really most people. I think, like, you have to look at, I don't know, MMO bites. I think they might be more in line with what most people would do. But I don't know if they read it or not. I don't really care about the story, but some people do. In fact, some people like really wanted English voice acting and wouldn't play the game if they didn't have English voice actor. You know, that's how much they care. So. Definitely not the best representation, if you ask me. The only thing they should do better is if they make it so that um, you can skip the level of process. Then that would truly be what we need. What the fuck? That was so cringe. You're doing homework right now, Chase? Well, you should do homework then. I guess that is what's going on.
Damn, I guess I have to hit both of them with the heart eater. So I can kill them at the same time. Level 30. Am I more ahead? No. I'm just, this is this is about the same level as I had last time, I think. Damn, so I'm not really any more ahead. Seven levels to go, though. Am I faster? It's been three hours and 30 minutes. Yeah, I guess it's a bit faster than the first time. But now we're about to reach... What is it? The level... 33 is where they make it faster, they said. That's the threshold we need to meet. For things to maybe speed up a bit. Drawing call. They're not doing homework. All right, I guess we'll see what you have to say. <laughs> What's hey, up, dude? What's up? I'm doing homework. Well, good luck on your homework. Damn, look at the bard go. Damn, I didn't even realize that guy was a bard. Test, test. Hello? Yeah, I hear you. Do you not hear me? Hey, do you not hear me? I hear you. Okay. I'm doing homework. Ah, my graduation, running. my graduation is tomorrow. Oh, congratulations. I have it at 12 p.m. I got chords, bro. You know what chords are? Chords? Like what? Chord. On, on the external perfect row? Or the chords. high call blade master? Like, it says chords. You put it on your neck. What? Graduation chords. No, I've never seen that before. <laughs> Is that a US Fuck. thing? I guess so, dude. A Texas thing? I guess so, dude. Damn. No, I've Fuck never seen that before. Graduation chords. Something mine? Is a what the oh, fuck? <laughs> That's new. I, I just had the tie thing, but I didn't have the cord, oh. like the skipping rope thing. I thought mm. it, I thought you were talking about cords, it, to be honest. Damn. I think you guys are retarded. Mm, no. Wayne wants your coordinates, Chase. He's ca calling in uh, orbital bombardment. <laughs> When guys <laughs> not to point to uh, PvP you in game <laughs> in perfect world. That's what I was referring to, the meme from external perfect world. Damn. What is this question? All right. How's the how, how's how, how's beta? Is it smooth so far? I think um, it's still pretty much the same. I mean, I'm leveling faster, but that's also because I now know what to avoid. But that's not really anything that they did. I just know what I shouldn't do now. And also, also this class, I don't know, maybe it's just bad at PvE, or I'm just bad at PvE, but I'm doing way less damage than my Berserker, so that's making it slower, too. 
Damn, he's just like half shot at that guy. What the fuck? Did the bod? Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. Was that just that, one skill? Like, that's what's why going I have to come and look at the bot go. What is going? What is going on? Like I'm just I'm just sitting here doing like one K damage. He's just doing like half of the HP in one go. What, what can I say? Should have played Bro, the bot. What is going on? I'm about Bro. to die. God damn. Look at the bot go. Damn, he has so much DPS. Where's my DPS? You should ask him. Ask the bard how to play Reaper? Yeah, why not? Uh... Because why? Why would I well, ask a bard how to play Reaper? No, you just ask him how, how he does so much damage. By using his skill? You never know. Maybe he uh, has a better weapon. All right, let me let's check it. So, is this the guy? Oh, wait, that's not the guy. That's the berserker. Where did the bar go? Fuck, he he left. No, Damn, who was that quick? This is the bard. Hmm. Mulao. Oh, he plus one his weapon. Damn, but that doesn't explain anything. That that's not that big of a difference. It's only like 0 0.5. Well, actually, I don't know how much 0 0.5 really is. But still. I mean, I could plus 5 my weapon. Or plus 1 it. It's basically free, so... No reason not to. But Damn. still. Did you check his HP? Nope. Damn. But how does HP affect his damage? Well, it's just uh, the gear status. I think I pulled too many again. This game has so much complex mechanics. Like maybe he has like the weird soul lantern thing. <laughs> the soul lantern? I don't know what it's called. Damn, what the fuck? Lantern, soul lantern? This guy also does more damage than me. It's a spear master, I guess. Why am why am I bad at PVE? Bruh. Time to eat my food Damn. maybe. Damn. Maybe this is what I'm missing. Damn, just doing no damage because your character is hungry. It is an RP game. I guess it all. makes sense. Like. Alright, we just need one more. I feel like I could be like twice as fast if I didn't do no damage for some reason. Damn. But the question is why? Damn, I did no damage on Berserker, doing no damage on Reaper. I guess I'm just bad at everything. <laughs> what can I say? You basically do no damage in every single game. Yeah. Even uh, Elyon. Did no damage on Perfect World either. Damn. Actually, the. Damn, even on Source of Online, did no damage. Also did no damage in BDO. Damn! Your entire gaming career is just doing no damage. <laughs> Damn! What is going on? 
Damn, which game did I do damage? Damn, I, play I, guess, break. I guess I did damage on uh, StarCraft too. Damn. Love overcomes all. Oh yeah. This is the weird boss. Actually, I really wonder, what even is this plot? This old man with his uh, rabbit teeth. Like, I, I did not under. Like, this plot was so confusing. Partly because I didn't read the story, but also just in general. Damn, even since three mobs, it's already difficult. Tush, tush, tush. Hello? Can you not hear me? No, oh, we. Wait, then why is face the same test? But my stream is, is, is I'm not muted on stream. Because <laughs> Chase is streaming. My volume not working on stream. Your chase is you're streaming right now? Aren't you doing no, homework? Volume... No, it's playing spell break. Why are you playing spell break instead of doing homework? What the fuck? <laughs> I finished my homework, bro. Bruh. That's pretty weird, champ. Alright, let me let's use this. Oh wait, again again a lot more. I get a lot more um in in incan what's it incantations when I when I use that stealth uh, ulti. Five major poisons and an emoji. Damn, I still got knocked down. What the fuck? I don't know why they speak in the emoji. It's pretty, uh, pretty out of place. Well. You see, back then, before writing was invented, they probably had to express themselves of uh, making faces. <laughs> but writing was definitely invented. Or maybe he couldn't read. Or talk. So they had to make faces. Oh my god. Damn, old man died and became a raccoon. Damn, man, she's just petting the <laughs> raccoon. What the fuck is this plot? Damn. Damn, she just blasted it off. Damn, maybe I should have followed the plot. Maybe I should have followed the plot so I know what the fuck that was about. Where else am I supposed to go? Yeah. Oh, I'm supposed to go here. Where else? Up there. Where else? Oh, inspect the items.
On the day after my wife died, my sixth brother bought me chicken rump, my favorite dish. How am I supposed to eat it now? I told him if God was this here, my please let me survive again the next life. I would never touch chicken rump again for the rest of my days. Of course, Damn. sniffing, it doesn't count. The sixth brother asked me how I would recognize her. She might be reborn as a cow, a snake, or a snail. Damn you, sixth brother. Don't you know I'm terrified of snakes? And when you can read? I told him I had to split the artifact and magic bow into it that each of us had to have. I would know. My wife, even if she was reborn as an ant, <laughs> if it came to that, I helped carry her very <laughs> cranes of rice and climb trees. On the 864th day after my wife's death, I felt a beautiful young girl in the forest. She had the big black first mark at the corner of her mouth, and the wolf being said, I thought, goodness, she looks just like my wife. The bell in my hand didn't ring, and she wasn't the right age anyways. I didn't have more time to look at her, so I discovered what to ensure she was not able to find her out of Wait, what? I didn't have more time to look like this. Her routine sure she was unable to find her way out of the true path forest, trapping her there for three hours. In the end, she sat down and started to cry. She cried just like my wife. I couldn't help but I had to let her suffer for three more hours. What? Today on the 9,620th day. What? Another Boy, thing came up with <laughs> And charm. She said she wanted to marry me. You have your young goodbye. Seriously, what do those young innocent girls know? They don't know it's like we this to be together for life as in death. They love only my looks, not my heart. It's so different. She let him look terrible. Turn her nose up at me. <laughs> oh, I so many years have passed. Or you actually yeah, remember the promise like, we made to each other. <laughs> Damn. Oh my On the 36th of the 918th day. I only saw her again. She was too trying to try to do it to me in front of everyone, but there was no mistake in that fashion in her eye. Don't worry about that. I won't train down. Even though you aren't beautiful in this life. <laughs> Even though you aren't beautiful in this life. Wait, wait, that. The queen them now come and see you. Okay, then. Damn. This guy has a different sense of time. Makes a general update once every like a thousand yeah. years. I guess that guy's immortal. Immortal forever waiting for his love. Damn. I guess I guess she is reincarnated after all. Love overcomes all finale. Damn. But I guess that guy didn't die. He just turned into a weasel. Damn. Damn. He was playing PW. He uh, turned into Fox Swarm and then lost the button. So now he can't turn back. Damn. I guess this is like the reverse perfect world debuff instead of... Actually no, this is like the Venomancer debuff. Where they turn you into an animal. Except that uh, has a permanent effect, I guess. Damn. Okay, now we're at the dragon. So we're almost at the snow place. And then once we're at the snow place, we'll be almost level 37. Damn! I guess the snow place is where things speed up. Yes. The snow place is where we just get 10k at a time. Damn. Once the snow place finishes, I'll be level 37. Hmm. I guess technically, if like we have few, like a party to do these quests, it would actually be like twice or three times as fast. Damn, you think so? I don't think so. You don't think so? I mean, look at how slow I'm killing the mobs. Well, it's because most of the time is time gated by traveling. So even if you do mobs, like, like if you one shot them, that time improvement will barely be over fifty percent. Nah, because I can travel to the mobs faster as well. Everyone post one mob and group together. Damn. You know, AOE. Damn. Next level coordination. What the fuck is that movement? This is the Spearmaster, I guess. 
JJ Uzumu. Yeah. Damn. You've seen Uzumu in their names. To smack them as the scythe three times. Nine dragon mirror chan the fuck? I aggro three. What? Well, it's time to die. I guess. That's why I popped my time reversal skill. So when I'm about to die. I just reverse time. Wait, I just killed Damn. him though. This is I didn't even need cost. the skill. I guess you reverse anyway to heal up. Well, I can't now, because I waited too long. Damn. Wait, what is Rimamun's? The fuck? You are exhausted. Wait, what the hell? Hold up. Can I not spam that? Wait, wh what, what even gave me that debuff? Hold up. Damn, there's no mob here. I can't test it. Damn, this is the equivalent of spamming X on PW. Wait, but see... Do rolls. Increases the damage. Oh, wait. So when I use this... It increases the damage of War Moon while this is active. But then once this wears off, I do less damage right after. Damn. So actually, I have to do burst all of my damage in the 15 seconds. Because afterwards, I get a debuff that does less, that makes me take do less damage. Huh. That's good to know. Yeah. You boys? Yep. Magical Lotus Tears. Magical Lotus Tears. What the fuck? Yep. Pillar of Fire. This is what we do now. This is the great major barrier. How come you can still move? The Guisham fire separated me from them. Okay then. <laughs> Okay then. Damn, I need my edge. There we go. And now I can... Oh wait, I forgot to do this first and then burst. And then reset. And then again. And then this again. And then this again. I, I, I don't know, maybe that's... Maybe that's optimal DPS, or maybe not. Oh wait, I forgot to hand in my quests. Yeah! I should hand in Didn't my quests Didn't hand in all your quests! I mean, what did they really give me, you know? What do you mean, they give XP? But do I really need XP right now, you know? Damn, I guess you have the luxury of uh, not accepting XP. I mean, I can accept them all in one go. Or I can yeah, accept them you now. Leaving the area? No, nah, not really, I'm still here. Damn. Oh wait, there's another quest here. Fuck. Or maybe I should finish them first. Wait, there was another quest here. Sil Solitary Lotus in the still water. Damn, still water. Oh, I remember this one. This was like one of the worst quests if I remember correctly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was this Ooh, one. Oh, I didn't mean to get that. Or 
Or is it? Damn, just looking at a flower pot. Yeah, this was this was the worst quest. Or one of the worst quests. I mean there were plenty of bad quests, but this is probably one of the worst. Damn. The flower pot's that heavy it slows you down this much. I know. I guess I guess it's a delicate pot, you know. I have to walk really carefully so the water doesn't spill out, you know, or and the dirt doesn't fall off. <laughs> I don't know if you ever moved flower pots before, but the dirt hardly falls off, even if you move quickly. Damn, but maybe this is like a really shallow flower pot, you know? You see, it, Damn, it's, it still it's, doesn't it's fall all up there. Easily. It's no, filled it's to the brim. Yeah. Okay, well then fine. You don't want the water to spill. Damn. It's I a, wa it's a that water that lotus. Sense. Why are you carrying it with one hand, bruh? Well, it's because, it's because you know Kung Fu. So it's actually easier to carry with one hand than two hands. Damn, sounds like you should just run then. <laughs> but no, running is uh, running is too much. Running is where we draw the line. <laughs> what is this? This Kung Fu techniques, man. <laughs> yeah. Too much limitations. <laughs> Damn! Two toads come out. But we have to stare at them for a few seconds before we can fight, you know? Oh wait, this is a share quest. That's convenient. Wait, is this share? No, they're attacking someone else. Where's the team at? And now I have to wait for them to suicide. Like, bro. Alright, 31. And I get a lotus step. What was that again? What's the lotus step? Oh, a collectible. Whatever. Um. Okay, still have to do this. Six levels to go. Yep. But uh, I think I just need to finish this region, and then it should speed up when it's when I get to the ice region. I think. At least I remember it being pretty fast for the last few levels. Yeah. It was the middle levels, like from like twenty-seven to like thirty-one. That was the slowest. Because now I'm starting to get like 6k EXP per quest. So that's where it starts to be better than dungeons. This dungeon is 10k. Uh, I need to go there. Or do I go there? No, I go here first. Uh, fuck. I was supposed to go through the entrance, probably. All right. Now I have to, like, go here. And then, like, down here. I guess that's fine. It works. Damn, someone just killed the boss. I have to wait for him to respawn. Oh, there we go. Alright. Open with this. Oh, wait. I, for I forgot to um, stack my thing again. And then reset. Fuck, he's he ran away. And then I do that again. 
And then that should kill him. So it's pretty good single target DPS. That's not good AoE. Damn. Yeah, but I do have to like use two two like mini ults to achieve that though. So I don't know if that's really all that good. Hmm. Wait, where am I supposed to? Oh, wait, no. I need to remove my personal marker first. There you go. That confused me a bit there. And now... The gods fire. And now we're moving on to the next region, I guess. This is basically the next region. More or less. Damn. Finally going to ice, I guess. Ice? No, we start with fire. Damn, I have to do fire and then ice. Oh, there's no ice, there's water. You know, remember Perfect World? What? Yeah. Fire. Earth. Metal. Wood. And, uh... Fucking Damn. water. No, the thing is, can I AOE them or am I just going to get wrecked? Well, there's an AI with me, so maybe I could AOE them. Let's see. Oh, I should, I should use that first. So I do more damage to my AOEs. All right. And that guy's good. What else do we have? This trap thing. Wait, I can just jump over them? Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? I thought you actually had to dodge them the first time, but apparently you can just jump over them. Lord Loud Damn, I wonder if Reaper is actually a bad PvE class or if I'm just bad though. Really, I really wonder. Because even with all of that, I'm still killing way slower than my Berserker. Damn. But yeah, like. This is still slower than Berserker. Damn, and he's still wrecking me. Alright, let's heal up for the final for the uh, final boss. The mini boss, no not the final boss. The final boss of fire. Alright. Lord 
Lao Tzu arrived at the Hangu Pass and erected a site for Taoist sermons. And my edge feels a solid here, okay. Start here. And then reset. I think I did like 2k there it was the uh, burst from all the DPS stat. That's like the highest it did so far. This is like another really slow part though. Cause I have to do like I have to do like five instances. And each of them really only give like mediocre EXP compared to how long it takes. So now we go to the. Oh no, wait, we have to do some things, do some uh, chores first. See, the chores give almost as much EXP. Or maybe even more EXP as doing an instance run. That's always been the thing with these PvE quests. It's almost like the easier they are, the more EXP they give. For some reason. Yeah. Damn, I wonder if I'll make level uh, 37 tonight. It's already getting late. But I guess I can probably still do another three hours. Maybe. I guess sleeping at 6 a.m. again. Or 2. Damn, what are you, I thought it was 2 a.m. for you right now. Damn. Guess not. Because you have to adjust for daylight savings. Yeah. But uh, normally, like... Well, I don't know. It's uh, midnight. Damn. Should I just kill them? I, I guess I just kill these two. Damn, I guess my APM is just 6 a.m. Alright, I need total of three. Reset. One more. Okay. So we got this done. Now we're going to the next element. Oh no, wait. Fuck. We still have to do this one. There. Wait, what? What the fuck? I couldn't hit. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. He just killed it. Unfortunate. Bro, I was trying to hit it. I couldn't hit it. What was that about? Just 
the spawn time is so long too. There we go. Alright, so now I can burst them down. Damn, I missed the hit too. That was really bad. What the hell? Nice of these mobs to wait for the cutscene to end before attacking me. supposed to do here another uh, I forgot what I'm supposed to do another one of these trick requests okay I'm supposed to okay that's what that's what I'm supposed to talk to it god damn okay Supposed to do this thing. Ah, uh, 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 could rain blast. I need to talk to this guy first before we continue. Okay, now we can. Now we're good. So much damage being taken. Even summon. I don't think I can even summon my companion in here. Yeah, I can't. I did get her though. It's time to upgrade her. So later, when I have to, if I have to do the dungeon, it will be easier. do we need? Kill all of these things as well. Damn, every time they die, they summon all of these metal core things. have to meditate after each battle. I know. Playing PW again. Actually doing so badly right now. Playing PW again after all this time. Blood, fire, water, gold. <laughs> all right.
He, the boss does way less damage to me than the mobs do. This is really just a single target class. Alright, that's metal. I wonder why it only does the spin animation on the fire one, but not on this one or any of the later ones. Okay. Accept. Just continue. Um, at least these one are just dig. Yeah, these one are just dig. Destruction of the United Demon Army. How much further are we? So I remember that after I finished the three elements, I think I just immediately move into the snow region. And I think the snow region I finished in like two hours, maybe? Or maybe one hour? What did they buff? Didn't they say they made something easier? They did, but... I'm assuming they give slightly more EXP. Damn. But probably not any significant amount for it to really matter. Spirit Dragon. Because I remember that um, when we were doing it, the first time, I had to like stop. Like I ran out of quest ribbon and I had to like do some uh, dungeons to finish it off. Damn. But I think what they did was that they made it so that you don't have to do dungeons anymore. From one quest to another, you just finish. Yeah, I guess so. Damn, when you only quit 200, feels bad. I don't even know if that's a crit. But what, what, what do the big red numbers mean? Yeah, I have, I have no idea. I don't actually Damn. know if it's a crit. It could be a crit, but I'm not sure. Cause I, uh, cause like I don't know what that number is. Like the big, huge minus one hundred three. I don't know what that means, Caesar. I thought that was the crit, but I guess not. I don't. I don't really know. Cause only certain skills trigger it. Like only this skill, for example, does that, or not this skill, the Wheel of Frost. And same with um, Simir's Berserker. There's like only one skill that triggers it. So I don't really know what that uh, thing symbolizes. Damn. Alright. They're dead. They are already dead. Okay. Which weakens the opponent's ring. Oh, I remember doing this the first time. And I just killed them without using the pearl. But apparently you're supposed to use the pearl. Which I guess, maybe that means Berserker's OP though. Because I killed them without the pearl and it didn't really feel any different. Even though you were meant to use the pearl. Well, OP at PvE, I guess.
All right, and we need. Damn, we really need. Oh, well, that was easy to kill at least. One more. What the heck? For some reason, my chat is being spammed. What? Look, I don't look, see look at this. It's just being spammed by Elan. Elan. Damn, that's your companion. Like, what is going on? Oh, there's a companion. No, here, that's. See, why, why is it being spammed? That's so weird. Is it because you scrolled up? No, I'm at, I'm at the lowest. Damn. I, gu I guess uh, your companion is lonely. <laughs> randomly spamming chat. All right. Unconsciousness. Oh, here's the second CC, I guess. Wait, extend every incantation for two seconds? Wait, what does that mean? Each curse extends the stun duration. Oh, okay, that's what it meant. Wait, alt is actually a way better translation. Every every incantation extends by two seconds, I think. So up to a, it's like a six second stun. Wait, that can't be right. There's no way that's a six second stun. Where am I going? Wait, where am I going? Up here? No, not up there. Down there, okay. Let's see if that's really a six second stun. Damn. I have to count to verify. But See, it's again. like PW, where the BM stun, I feel like it's not actually six seconds. It's a, it's a random varied. Random varied? What? Yes. How's, I don't they, think that's possible. How, how do people on 1.3 time it perfectly every time then? If well, they random. don't time it perfectly every time. They do, though. What? Yeah, they time it perfectly every time. No, they don't. They lock you for like they only two minutes. Time it, they time it perfectly like half the time. I mean, but two minutes is basically every time, I would say, if they can lock you for two minutes. Well, they can't lock you for two minutes every well, time. They can, though. No, they can't. Yeah, like, they, I, I've yeah, never no, seen a video of a 5 ping BM locking another 5 ping BM for two minutes. I mean, there's been videos, though. But I don't think we Show have it what? anymore. We, we don't have it anymore. Because uh, I'm pretty sure it doesn't exist. Well, how would you know if you're a 5 ping BM or not? Well, you can sort of tell, like, from watching them play. But they could just be... I don't know. See, um, the thing is, so. when you have high ping, your movement kind of, like, directly translated in real life is like, well, why is this person so slow? Yeah, but like, not when it's like between 5 ping versus 10 ping versus like 20 ping difference. Well, 5 ping versus 10 ping isn't that much different. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, so, so why are you bringing so it up? So it'll be hard to tell. No, like but you, you can tell not. if... Yeah, but like... You, I, I, I played on high ping before, right? So I kind of know what high ping looks like. Yeah, but like there would still be a difference between like 5 ping versus like 20 ping. Not really, there's like barely any difference. They're just fast. Like, alright. If you're asking me if I can tell the difference between 5 ping versus 30 ping, I probably cannot. But I can tell the difference between 5 ping versus 300. Yeah, of course. But, like, five, like between, like, I don't know, like 5 ping to, like, I don't know, somewhere like 30, it would still, it would, there would be a bit of difference in terms of yep. whether you can lock or not. Yep. But, but I can't tell the difference. Like, 
at least one good video. So then, so okay, so then we just need, so basically we just need someone with like less that's not lagging. Is what you're saying? Yeah. Okay. Well, we don't have that because video anymore. I, though. I swear, I haven't seen a video of any BM locking another BM on low ping for two minutes. Yeah, but I don't it's think a, we have, it, I don't think we have videos anymore. It was, I mean, it's it was already very difficult to to lock a five ping BM. Because your margin of error is literally like so low. Maybe you should have uh, figured that out back when people were still playing PW. What? Figure what out? Whether it's RNG or not. And I, I, I have, I had a feeling it was RNG. A slight RNG. Yeah, but no one plays PW now, so it's gonna be hard to find videos again. Damn. So maybe you should have figured that out. See, the reason why playing, so. I think so is because through a raw lock, raw bash, raw rotation. I don't know why. Sometimes the wall goes off so early that the bash stun is still there, and sometimes it goes off perfectly. Like I don't really know why that's happening. When you're lagging or when you're on fight ping? No, no, this was uh, on the uh, Saddle PW. Sometimes the bash, like the the, the second wall after the bash goes off before the bash stun even wore off. And that's theoretically not possible given the uh, cooldown and stun durations. So it was super weird. Because um, raw, raw cooldown is 14 seconds, right? Bash well, bash is uh, bash plus raw is 13.5. So how can the second raw literally go off cooldown, um, before the uh, bash stun has even faded? Well, it's actually happened before, in uh, my video, because if you remember, there was a video where I was one v one in Neo, and um, like my head, one of my uh, headhunt stun lasted longer. Then uh, six, uh, five seconds. So, and we were never able Damn. to figure out why. Damn. So maybe you can uh, take a look maybe there. Maybe it's RNG and you see like, if there's any reason. Connection. I don't know. I can send you the video if you, if you don't know what I'm talking about. No, I don't know what you're talking about, but uh, you, you don't know what I I'm understand talking about? the the effect, like, because because it's probably like you can only fit like three skills in the stun, but you fit it in four. Yeah, but you didn't even watch every one of my video. Damn! But do you expect me to remember every video? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what is this meme, bro? <laughs> don't remember each video. Damn. Don't even remember the videos I watched yesterday. Yeah. And why even watch videos? What do you mean? Say you're just gonna forget it. <laughs> what do you mean? What? Yeah, but I guess I guess it'll be good. Movies will be good for you. Like you can just rewatch a movie every day because you forget it immediately after watching it. So it will. So you'll always uh, have the plot twist. You know, you can just watch Star Wars <laughs> every day and experience it like you were watching it the first time. What? Some well, people would, see, dream, uh... would dream to have that power, you know? What the fuck? Bruh! Well, to be fair, like, every time I watch Star Wars, I always end up being like, Whoa, I don't remember this happening. Damn. See, some, some people would pay a lot of money to have that power. Damn. Well, you see, some people would have, would pay a lot of money to uh, retain knowledge better. Well, I mean, technically, it's not really knowledge. It's entertainment, like you said, so maybe it's fine. Yeah, but like, it, it, it's, it's not like you can choose to turn it on for what video <laughs> you're watching. Maybe you could, and you just haven't realized the on-off switch yet. What the fuck? I guess we're all computers now. You just have to find it. Like, you just have to activate your full potential. Damn. You just have yet to realize your full potential. You are still only a student one. 
Damn, not even a student. Quick. They should, they should honestly just call this like these levels janitor one. Janitor two. <laughs> Bruh. Janitor 32. I mean, what's lower than a student? It's the janitor, right? There's, there's nothing lower than the student. Well, no, because you can't really get demoted from a student to a janitor. So I don't think janitor is lower than student. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah, I, I thought you can back in the day. What? Yeah, like your punishment is basically cleaning. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> I mean, if you think of it that way, I guess. Where all the other students has gone home after hard days of training and you have to stay back and clean the classroom <laughs> hmm. But that's more like I don't know Slavery because you're not getting paid whereas genders are paid Damn I can see even worse than the janitor <laughs> Yes Damn, rain disperses poisonous clouds. The gimmick mechanics. Well, this isn't just any rain, this is sacred rain, so. Yeah. Sacred rain blaster. So, what did we do so far? We did fire, we did meadow, we did water, now we're at wood, and then there's one more after this. Damn! Getting rid of the poison gas spawned enemies. Might as well kept the poison gas here. Well, no, the whole point is to uncorrupt them. You see, we're the good guys here. Damn, uncorrupt them by killing them. It's like Pokemon. See, what? We, we, we almost kill them and then we save them. You know? No, you know, it's like in yeah. Pokemon. You, you almost kill them and then you capture them when they're almost dead. Damn. So it's just like that, we almost killed them, and then we purify them. <laughs> Damn, just... I guess that makes sense. It's pretty good meme, to be honest. Alright, there we go. To cut this tangle up with a sharp knife. This is a little bit of 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 a little a scythe. I thought scythe is meant to cut down plants. I should have bonus damage against these, mo these mobs here. They're so tanky. This is gonna go stealth for the extra damage just to kill them faster. Damn. No, only this game. Damn. I thought it was every game since you don't do a damage in every game. Well, no, that's just because I'm bad. Damn. But see, I, I thought uh, the gear would mitigate some part of being bad. You know, if you have equal gear, then by pressing 1, the 1 would uh, do equal damage. 
Nah, that's not how it works. Damn. The more, the better just... you are at the game, the more damage you do. Damn. That is rule number one. But well, see, that's only true if you if you if all else is equal. Right? No, it's, it's true in every circumstances. What do you mean? <laughs> that's what I mean. What do you mean? How, how can that plus zero on PW do more damage than plus twelve? Depends on how good you are. What? Yep. I mean, the guy can literally just press one button and he does more damage. Mm, but not if you're better than him. What? How's yep. that possible? Ah, only once you become good will you understand. Damn. Guess that's not happening. <laughs> Unfortunate. Damn, how dare you touch my husband. Damn, but I guess she doesn't join the fight when we were fighting her husband. So, in fact, her husband died Venus of her. Damn. Reminds me of that uh, house episode where the woman was poisoning the husband. What? I mean, this is more like indirect. Damn, I guess that's true. I'm just saying it as a metaphor. Damn, that's actually like a six second stun though. If it consumes three incantations. But I guess the trade-off is in order to stun, I do less damage. Because the incantation is also used for damage. So I have to choose between stunning or damage. But why wouldn't I stun? Hmm. See, it, a lot of things change once you get these last few skills. So I can't make a decision early on whether the class is going to be good or not. This is a Alright, let's just have to clean up a few more mobs. This is like the longest part of the story. Oh my god. What? This guy literally just set up like three meetings. <laughs> That's funny. I feel sorry. Any sadness. I am sorry for your loss. Okay. Two more. With both of my ults, I was able to kill it without take without dying. Kill four in a row. I guess that's uh, an achievement. Getting better at this, I guess. By using alts. I smell tasty Okay. Now we just have to. I think there was a mini boss here we had to kill. Um. Finish this. Oh, we teleport up first. Now, what you draw less than she did. 
Damn. What am I supposed to do again? <laughs> Complete the quest. Fuck, I'm out of inventory slot. You have got to be kidding me. Damn. Time for you to consume the junk. Uh, Alright, let's see here. I guess I don't need this. This is a scrap of clothing. I guess this is old gear. I don't need. Fuck, my pet is full. Uh, what are these things? Just various materials. Oh look, Sasu's awake. Oh, is she? Nice. Maybe she had a Oh, I guess some jades. Um, what did I want? Damn. Taking a did bot for PvP. Alright, these ones I need I can use to improve my gear. Um what is this? This is like useless. This is consumable. Uh remain active can extend the effect through cooking. So that's like cooking stuff. Uh wait, what? What does it mean? Improve. Improve? To the book of increase my destiny. Wait, what? I don't even know what that does. Greater chance to increase the level of equipment identifying it. I guess, I guess technically I should be saving up some of these. Like some of these are actually good. Like this gives like more damage. This gives better... Actually no, that's not the food. This is the food. This gives more damage though. So. I guess technically I shouldn't waste them, but this is the close beta, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Damn. Time to write that down. Don't waste these items. Yeah. But I mean, in, once the open beta, like once the game releases, I would just be put, going back to putting these things in my bank, I think. Damn, but do you even have a speed bank? Run. Yeah, of course we have a bank. Ever seen the bank? So yes, because, the bank is going bankrupt soon. Nobody's it. using the service. Just because you haven't seen it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Well, you see, uh, bank needs customers. If it has no customers, it'll go bankrupt. And if no one's using the bank, then uh, the bank's going to go bankrupt soon. Well, the pro players are using the bank. Just not me. Damn, but that's not enough. Mm, it's enough, because they pay extra to use it. Damn, but that's still not enough, you see. Well, it is enough. That's why they're not going out of business. What do you mean? They might be enough. going out of business right now. Nah, they're still in business. Because it's enough. Damn, but you don't know if it's enough. Of course I know it's enough. Damn, how do you know if it's enough? What do you mean? Because they're in business right now. But they're not in business. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn, this guy does more damage than me. Everyone does more damage than me. Damn. Waiting for the day I hear. Damn, I'm doing more damage than the other players. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's even a possibility. Damn. Maybe you should add that to your uh, buck list before you uh, pass away in real life. Damn, but... Find an MMO where you are doing more damage than other players. But I should probably add uh, realistically achievable things to the bucket list. Damn. Chen Xi Ziren, he said that he was a few years ago, but he still couldn't see him. All right, some statues. Uh, 
What was next? Let's just open the gate, I think. Yep. And now... This is the final world. We're almost at 37 after this finishes. But first, I will uh, be right back. All right, I'm back. Damn. I guess uh, you're also back. Indeed. Well, oh wait, these, this last one is pretty easy, I remember. It's just the boss that I have to kill. Easier than having but, to kill a bunch of mobs. But this rock is not in the lake. <laughs> nah, that's what you think. What do you mean? Do you see water? Water is part of the mind. If you believe is there is water, then there is water. What is this uh, Kung Fu Panda shit? Use the water within you. Are you telling me to pee? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, is the dodge is an eye frame? Right? Pretty sure I, I, I dodged that, but I still got hit.
Actually, he's called the Rock of the Deep, not even Rock in the Lake. <laughs> no, but the HP bar says I know. Rock in the Lake. I know. But see, you just have to believe that there's water, then there will be water. Oh my god. When you have chi, is anything is possible. All you need is chi. Actually, just didn't Kung Fu Panda have like this one uh, episode where it's like entirely about chi? And chi was basically magic in there too. Yes, but you see, chi cannot summon water out of nowhere. Well, that's what you think. But this isn't Harry Potter. Actually, no, in Harry Potter, you could summon water. You just couldn't make food. Which is actually pretty weird. How come how come you can't make food but you can summon water? They maybe what's happening is food. it's not summoning. Um, with, with water, they're just pulling out like the water in the air. Damn, so water benders. Like an avatar. Indeed. But with food, you probably like need a chicken to start off. Damn, but you can duplicate food that's already made. You just can't make new ones from scratch. Wait, 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 wait. You, you can summon the food. Didn't didn't Dumbledore do that in like one of the early episodes? No, but that's like only only you have no, but you can only duplicate existing food. You can't summon food from scratch. I think was the rule. But I thought Dumbledore summoned all the food from scratch. I thought it would. Wait, I don't. No, those are already prepared food. No, you can summon food. But you can't like make them out of thin air if they have never been made. Like, uh, you can I only thought those fruit was uh, made, like like made out of thin thin air. I, I uh, didn't realize it, it was uh, already. Actually, I don't know then. <laughs> In that yeah. case, I have no idea. Wait, what? Wait, so this is a stun, but it doesn't work in PvP? Because that stun the target for five seconds, but in PvP you regenerate five incantations. So does that mean it doesn't stun in PvP, or what does that mean? I'm confused. Maybe it's like extra, like, like if it's PvP, you also get five incantations. That would be ideal. But I wonder if that's how it works. I guess we'll wait and we'll see. We will find out. Damn. Can't believe your class has so less CCs that you're actually praying to God that the skill ends up being a CC. Wait, why why wouldn't I want it to be a CC though? Any any class will want them will want their skill to be a CC. I know. But I'm just saying you have so few CCs you're actually praying to God <laughs> that wow. a skill that says I that it CCs people is actually going to CC people. Right, you can never have too much CC. You don't Damn, need to pray to God. That is indeed true. It's uh, maybe a demon, but she's the most beautiful demon in the whole world. Damn, even See, more meetings. See, these these guys are just um They just like uh fox girls, but people like fox girls even nowadays. So are people bewitched by fox spirits in modern days? Damn. That's the question. I think they're just bewitched by females. You know, it doesn't <laughs> have to be fox girls. Damn. It's that bad, huh? Because I guess in uh, Chinese lore, fox girls are uh, demons. Yes, I guess that's true. Unfortunate. And then you guess those group these were up.
Fox Spirit God. Damn. I'm suddenly getting all of these CCs that I didn't have when leveling up. Damn. I guess all it's right. like wizard. No, no CCs up until you become demon. Oh, even demon wizards don't really have CC. Wizards just aren't meant to really CC. It's just RNG CC. Yeah. But see, RNG CC is better than no RNG CC. Uh, true. Any CC is better. But unless you're playing external perfect world, I guess. What? Yeah, see, on external perfect world, you win Sage. Well, you see, I went Sage for a reason. You see, if I could get all the books, then I would actually go Demon. But since <laughs> I was expecting to have no books, I thought the uh, cheat skill would be more use <laughs> than the Demon one. Well, I guess you ended up being correct. It's called planning ahead. Damn, in that external perfect world video, did they even have uh, full skills or no? I don't even remember. I don't think they did. Damn. I don't even know what weapon the wizard had. Damn. Where's the boss? Um, it's funny because um, I, I, I know on external, like before I, I think it was like before I quit, there was this one cleric where Neil flamed her in the FC. But then once I played in for her, she had like plus seven everything. And that was like in January. Was that bad or was that good? I forget. No, that was. Th it's really good because it's probably like the best geared cleric on the server. Huh. Oh, that's pretty good then. Nothing wrong with that. The big naive fox spirit. All right. Damn. I think this is the last quest in this region. I could be wrong, but I I remember this was near the end. I'm already starting to see ice. Oh shit! But after I get into the ice region, there was that one very annoying instance quest where I where I died multiple times because I, you had to like kill the mob while dodging um. Projectiles at the same time. Damn. I guess need to get good. Too hard to get good. Indeed. But it's good practice, you see. Maybe it's preparing you for PvP. Well, there's not. I don't think there's really like much dodging in PvP, to be honest. Damn. I thought this was an action combat. It is, but... Like, I mean, like, you can dodge spells, right? Like... It is, but also... It's kind of just... It's not really done in a way where, like, you can really dodge. I've tried out my skills since Master Mage advised me, but I'm going to test like, myself against you today. Like, if you use an instant skill that, like instantly moves you, then yeah, you can use that to dodge, but a lot of the times the spells are just too fast for you to really realistically dodge them. So. Damn. So it's, it's not really a shooter. Like, if, like, you're thinking spell break. In spell break, you can dodge attacks. Because they're slow enough most of the time. Well, if you're talking about fireball, that is. But this game, what? not really. 
I guess in this game, right, that, like there's only one skill that does the most, like a lot of damage. So you just basically have to dodge that one. Yeah. But Use you, the skills then, you've like, learned to defeat the enemy. But then it's like... What the fuck just happened? Damn. I guess you got sucked into the bell. <laughs> what the fuck? A bell? I don't think that's a bell. That's like one of those um, private private rooms that newlyweds go, go in. Damn! Oh, okay, I, I see what you mean. I didn't <laughs> see the opening. <laughs> and we saw the back side. But damn. But, um... I don't really know. If you will really be able to dodge, though, because they'll probably CC you. No, they'll probably <laughs> CC you like... before doing their uh, combo on you. And you're not going to be able to dodge or CC. Wait, you're, you're speaking Chinese, dude. I know. Yeah. I know, it's so weird. And now she switches to English. It's so scuffed. <laughs> Tell me this voice actor doesn't sound like a guy with a high voice. <laughs> Damn, but I, I, you're going to make the voice actor feel bad. Can't be me like no, that. Just, it's just uh, when they hired, they couldn't find a female intern. <laughs> they had to tell the guy to speak in a high voice. Damn, you're really insulting the voice actor now. What do you mean it's not insulting? Well, see, if it was actually a female voice actor, then, you know, they would be pretty insulted. Damn, I guess that's true, but <laughs> I, I doubt it's a female voice actor. <laughs> see, I guess doubling down on the insult. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Well, Good thing they're well, not uh, at least watching they the stream. Uh, Yes, indeed. <laughs> I'd also be quitting their jobs. Yeah. Going to a different country, starting all over again. What else do I have to do? I should be almost done here. Damn, I swear I was almost done. I guess I'm still doing a few gathering. Oh, I guess a new weapon. That's right. Um, I think I'm just coming back here and then leaving, right? Okay, so I come back here. Ring the bronze bell. What was this again? What the fuck? I don't even know what that was. Okay. Get the seal stone. And oh yeah, yeah. That's right. This is this is the one that I was talking about. The other Damn. really annoying quest. Alright. I guess I just kill them one at a time. Because I don't think I can, like... Target them. I don't think I can AoE them, because I already have trouble AoEing them, like... On the world map. But here, I'm also trying to, like, dodge projectiles at the same time. Well, actually, the projectiles haven't really started yet. So I could AoE a few of them right now. Ah, fuck. Nah, it's, it's already starting to be a lot of damage. Damn. Alright, let's go for the stun here.
Yeah, it, it's already starting to be a lot of damage. Damn, maybe you need to uh, go back in time to heal up. Well, I didn't activate the spell, so now I can. Damn, maybe you should have activated it. Nah, I wasn't expecting to die. And uh, I'm not going to die because I'm not expecting to. Damn. See, even death, pro player now. even death is in the mind. Damn. If your mind doesn't die, you don't die. You know? Damn. <laughs> What if there are any uh, scenarios in real life where that's actually true? Like your body is just completely destroyed, but your mind is uh, still functioning. Doesn't... I heard that oh, I um, if you get beheaded, don't you like have a few seconds <laughs> of consciousness? <laughs> I, I don't know how they would verify if that's true or not though, so... But that's what I heard. Damn. Well, I guess no one can verify it. I know. No, no one would ever know. Un unfortunate. But it's that. But that's still what it said. Maybe it's true. It takes a bit of time for your brain to die, I guess. Okay, yeah. so I'm just gonna kill these one at a time. Just the projectiles are starting. Damn. I guess that guy's the Berserker who's helping me. He's literally using the Berserker skill. But all he's doing is auto attacking. It's not very useful. Dodge the projectiles. Damn, the dragon turret. Yep. Shooting slow blue balls. It's a very slow dragon, what can I say? It's like when it's like how dragon breathes fire, but instead it's Slow blue balls like that. Very yeah. unique species of dragon. But it is what it no is. wonder they extinct and turn <laughs> into statues. <laughs> it is what it is. All right, stage three. And this is the annoying mob too. Where it just keeps charging at you. Can you read this move? I guess I just go in here. Just possess him. To dodge the attack. I guess I'll go for the stun. Damn, the ice healing. I've never seen that before. That's the first time I had seen the ice heal. Damn. Really doesn't look like anything special. Majesty will avenge me. The wind is raging today. You're just a rookie. Uh, damn! I touched the barrier at the edge, and I took 400 damage. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna point it out. We can stop charging me. All right, next stage. Okay, so this is just two. Damn. But now I'm don't, like don't getting attacked even... by like... 
Damn, four don't even get now. a chance to meditate. I could have meditated, but since it's only two, I don't think it was really necessary. Damn. I don't think I need to meditate versus two mobs. Fuck. Maybe Damn, I should have meditated. He's taking a breather. Maybe I should have meditated. Well, I, I, I just, guess I you just can meditate I, after I just, this. I just took damage from the turret. That wasn't supposed to happen. I was supposed Damn. to dodge the turret. Damn, almost went to the wall again. No, that was that was calculated. I perfectly timed the distance or measured damn. the distance. The damn, it's that's still shooting you. Of course. Jonas is gonna let you meditate. Yeah, but the other mob is. She's just chilling. <laughs> that's because I'm in her blind spot. She can't see me. Damn. Whereas the turrets good. Whereas their turrets. Fuck! Oh, I just lost the 480 that I just med I meditated. Damn. Damn, this, this lady is uh, more blind than I am. <laughs> okay, I think that's the final stage. There we go. Alright. No death like this time. Fish fin lap. Zero death. That's pretty good. Damn. Maybe this oh, class is the class for you. Was there another? Oh wait, there was a final boss. I, I forgot. I have to kill the final boss. But I'm not gonna die to Damn. the boss. Was that a snake? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna die to the boss though, so it's fine. Oh, it's rocks. That was a snake. No one ever dies to the boss. Damn. Maybe they shouldn't be bosses. They should be demoted. <laughs> it's Maybe they got promoted to uh, nepotism. I mean, it's it just goes to show how good zerging is. Like, you can be a boss, but the six people zerging you is instantly better, you know? You can you can be the best player, but six average players zerging you just instantly wrecks you, you know? It just goes to show. It's just like in PvP. It's just like in PvE. Zerging Damn. is just overpowered. Even in real life, zerging is still overpowered. Hey, what's up, Dante? Damn. I got more views on Elion? I don't think so. But it doesn't really matter. Hello. Damn. Another viewer. Hello, guys. Hello. No, I don't think so. Yo, Wayne. What matters is Hello? how many people you have that are like Hello? Um I guess dedicated. Damn, I guess NBA is over. Dante is back. I guess so. Why is Chase cosplaying as Ari? I actually have no idea. Uh, I, guess I, know you, why. I guess you have to ask him. It's because um, Chase made a deal with him. Uh, he wanted Sin Lessons, and in return, he has to promote the Arishi brand. 
Damn. That is so P. Time to use my special ability. Damn, special ability is a lunar eclipse. That's yep. pretty OP. I can teleport within the same map. Isn't Ariashi a literal dog player? Is he dog? Is he actually dog? I, I have no idea. All I know I is thought, that I he, he was considered than, a good player, though. Levi. Was he? Was he? I have no idea. The guy's ego is big as uh, Levi. Yeah, I am Ariashi, bro. Are you Ariashi? I never even see him fight, only talk on world chat. Well. Honestly, I haven't even really played with Ariashi that much. Oh, Wally made a video of me, bro. <laughs> yeah, Wally had the Ariashi effect video. But um, man, I don't. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, what, you never seen his video? No, I don't Ariashi, see man. Yeah, I guess I'll link it to you. I've I've only seen a comment on I think it was PW Explain IMO where uh, Ariashi was uh smacked him in the face with uh, his verbal attacks. <laughs> uh, yeah, I remember. Those are pretty good memes. But Wally does have a, his own channel where he is famous in his own right. Damn. Um, I think he actually used to have a channel where he where he like wasn't toxic. But then he deleted that channel for some reason. So I guess uh, he he denounced his old ways of being non-toxic and decided to become a toxic person instead. What a legend. Ugh. Heroic events? Fucking hell, I don't, I don't care about that. Wait, I'm at level 33. There was supposed to be a What request. is this quality? What? This video quality. Oh, I mean, that's, uh, that's Wally. It's like 20, 240p. Bruh, I guess you're dissing Wally's video. Neil has fainted. Yeah, have you seen this? <laughs> nice. What do you mean? What? Of course I've seen the video. Tell me this is not like 240p or some shit. <laughs> What? It, it is what it is, bro. Bro, where am I supposed to go next? What the fuck? I thought I thought they fixed this. I thought they fixed the quest gap. There was a quest gap, and they, and they were supposed to have fixed it. Damn. Yes, what you happened? Have to go back to grinding dungeons. What happened? Where's the quest gap? Where's the fix? Bro, what is this fake news? Alright, well, I guess I might as well deposit everything in the bank before I go. Uh, it is, where is it? Stash. There it is. Are we actually played Syndicate? Yeah, he played Syndicate for a bit, but never really had the chance to really interact with him, as far as I recall. So. Damn. Guess you never fought him. I mean, he was in Mass PK a few times. But that I was, thought he was a it. 1v1 player. I guess he might have been a 1v1 player, but he was definitely in Mass PK a few times. Yeah. And that's the only times I've seen him. Aside outside of that, I never really had the chance to really interact with him, so. 
I don't really know too much about yeah, that. Yeah, I did my homework, Wayne. Okay, hey, congratulations. Are you actually too OP? The Ariashi brand. Dude. I remember that assassin Nick on uh, Inception, dude. What? I remember everyone so... saying Nick was like the best assassin. You remember I that, don't Dante? I know what this is. Yeah. Um, I guess these other gear pieces I can just sell. Everyone was saying Nick was like the best assassin. Damn. But see, in Inception's, uh, it's like the definition of a small pool. Actually, I didn't they need said to repair I was my the best gear. BM, but in reality, I was the only BM on the server. Well, it takes a lot of skill to become the best BM when no one plays BM, though, so... What do you mean? If no one's dead, then by default, you're the best. Well, no. If no one's there, it means the class is bad. No, no one wanted to play BM. No, it means the class See, is I bad. still wouldn't stop complaining that BM was overpowered. Nah, but see, if no one plays, then the class is bad, though. Damn. That's how it works. If Damn, the class is good, everyone would play it. Let's be honest. Have you, you, you know BDO? Flavor of the months, everyone always rerolls to the best class. Damn. So if no one's rerolling to the class, oh, the you? class isn't good. Nick was better than Chase had Assassin? Yeah, probably. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Wait. I'll talk new skill, bro. This ring is better. What the f wait, why is this ring worse? Oh no. Okay, this is the bad ring. Oh, it's because I have two different rings, so it like fucks up. I'll talk new skill. Which one I should be using. Yeah, it's because I have two earrings and two rings, but it doesn't replace the right one. Same problem as PWI. Damn, I have meetings. Alright, BRP. Alright, see ya. Oh, dude. Alright, I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, enhance everything, because why not? Doesn't cost anything. And I have uh, free PvE stones anyways, that I'm never going to use otherwise. Alright, so what do I do now, though? I guess... I guess it's either... Biography? Or Dungeons. And I think the answer is Dungeons. I think Dungeons is gonna be better. Salakin, the dude was hella good, but he was hella maddy. Wait, who are you talking about? Salakin that was maddy, or are you talking about Nick? Was maddy. Dude, Anthony is literally Salad Kingdom. Wait, this one gives 24k EXP? When did I even unlo unlock this? Dante, you know Anthony is Salad Kingdom, bro? Salad Kingdom. Oh, was he? Was Anthony mad? Yeah. I guess you Anthony, should, uh... Anthony is Salad Kingdom, you didn't know that? I guess you should ask him if he was mad. Or He's in a meeting now, bro. I know, after the meeting. Bro, Dante, I don't blame I don't blame him for hating you, bro. I would have trashed on you too, bro. Damn, really? I guess you guys didn't have uh, that good of a relationship. <laughs> I, just, I, I, met, I, met, I, met, I met Dante through giving him free gear, I think, and then we played League of Legends. Was well, hated by a lot and of I, people. And I, st I still wreck Dante. Damn. <laughs> and I was only 13, bro. I don't know if that's really a good thing to be hated by a lot of people, though.
You don't even remember Chase on Inception? Damn, bro. You're, you're sitting now, now, bro. Just like when? I guess you guys didn't meet on Inception. Dude, how do I do my quizzes? I'm actually kind of pissed. Thought you were done your homework. I did, but I want to do more just to get stuff. Oh, you met him because Cupy. Damn. Cases of death and injury are unavoidable while Reaper students are on. Nah, bro. I was playing. I met. I actually met Dante by myself. His name was like Flaco or Flacco or something. And then I gave him free gear. It's kind of ironic because like he didn't like farming back then. But I, 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 I was farming back then, bro. I guess the role has reversed. And then we played League of Legends after. And then he was like playing Lee Sin. Go ahead, I wrecked him, bro. I guess now you're the one who doesn't like farming and he's the one who likes farming. This matter must be kept secret, but you have asked the envoy of the turquoise land. Well, I remember everything because Yeah, I'm I met you on Inception, bro. I wrecked you, you remember? Black Flacker or something. Something like that. Damn. I oh, guess that was, was Mafia. Mafia. Damn, I oh, guess like Chase that. is the one who said now. But how am I supposed to remember that, dude? I was like, my brain was still developing, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm supposed to do the soul journey to do this quest. Damn. Dude, how do my orientation quiz, bro? I'm so mad. I need to do. I need to do the soul journey. I guess this is a pretty difficult quest. Oh, Sean. Are you going to the spirit I'm world? Right Your birthday. Are you? <laughs> Nothing okay, in particular. All right. Now. I guess I will let you do your quiz. Inception was a good time. Damn, I think Syndicate was a good time. The soul seeking rope may not be used against him for too long, or his soul will be lost in the afterlife. So you have to be too careful. scared to play there? I was bored. What do you mean scared? It was a boring meta where no one died. The soul seeking rope. Wait, what the fuck? How am I supposed to use this? Oh, like this. Ming Yang Wang, you are a loser who can't even pass the warlock guard training. You use the power of the envoys of the turquoise lantern to torture your own people. If you have even a trace of shame in you, then never return to the Heavenly Ridge. Damn. Uh, uh, don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, let me think. I, I guess they're just torturing this guy. When I saw a beautiful person through the window, she came in here <laughs> and sat next <laughs> What the me. fuck? We're just torturing this guy in the spirit world. Syndicate was too, but it was uh, like that long. Yeah. Syndicate, uh, it never really caught on. Pretty unfortunate. I'll tell you, honest, that's enough. His soul can't take any more. If you question him again, he won't be able to be reborn as a human in his next life. And betrayed the goddess Nuwa. If you were in my place, would you betray another secret and betray someone else? Someone who should never be betrayed? Yeah, the English voice acting, we were commenting on that earlier. It, that doesn't sound as really that good. It's like some of them are, I don't know. This is Wei Xiang's mask, which I found <clears throat> under the table when I came in. It's so I think it's probably have best balance of any private server I play. Damn. Hola. It was that good, huh? 
But maybe that's why nobody played Syndicate. Because people want certain classes to be OP. So a balance game actually is bad. Like, what is going on here? The fuck? She's just doing a dance performance. While we are here trying to investigate someone's death, he's just doing a performance. Uh-huh. Wiz was already talked to on every private server. Well, probably not Void. Congrats on the uh, graduation, man. You hear me, dude? Hello? Yeah, what's up? Bruh. The first void. I'm fine. Or was, or was it the second void? People in Wenshang restaurant that the immortal Wenshang had a close friend. Dude, I'm fine to graduate tomorrow, bro. It was from yeah, congrats. Three years ago to the day. Reality gonna hit hard, man. Yep. But I guess at least I'll be able to play uh, solo. No, what the heck? I'm already in college. I can't play games, bro. Oh, first year of college is when you play games. Third and fourth year is when you don't play. Wait, you don't actually Wizard was best class? I don't know. Everyone played Archer and Boy. No one played Wizard. They see me run. Um, oh wait, but I think you probably played after I quit, maybe? Was it after, like, when I did the balance test with Neil? Was my Wizard vs. Sisson? If so, then Wizard was pretty good there. But before that, Archer was, like, the best class. Alright, I guess they're still doing homework. Archer got nerfed. Yeah. I guess I have to defeat him. Or defeat her. To bring her back to her senses. Okay, yeah. That was like after I did the balance test with Neil then. But that's strange because it closed once and then I guess it opened again later on but by then we already moved on this magic can't last long please speak quickly if you have something to say wait while they say their goodbyes because I'm a man of my word it, it's... it's just so weird when they talk in both Chinese and English and it's mixed. It's so scuffed. All right, biography completed. 24k, still not enough. Should I just do this, maybe? I should just do this, maybe. Like, like what's, what's the worst that happens? I go to the village. Actually, how do I even go to the village? You go to the highlands first. And I get like 9k EXP. I'll, I'll unmute you once you're uh, finished your homework and everything. So maybe tomorrow.
I don't know, you were you were still doing your homework earlier, so like like just a few minutes ago. EPM was always so peak, because every server nerfed Sin and Barb. Well, every server nerfed Sin. I don't know about Barb. Barb was like pretty OP in uh, Void as well, I think. EP OP, that's true. Wizard OP? Eh, maybe. But uh, anyways, I'm just saying like... Like maybe, maybe that's just the meta that people like, you know? Like maybe Syndicate was actually died because the meta wasn't what people wanted. You have to appeal to the demands. Sin was nerfed on Vendetta? I don't like. I only played the retail version of Vendetta. It was nerfed on Inception, I remember that. They made Sin right. do. They removed like attack levels from Sin or something. Yo, are you stupid? No, I'm not. Yeah, I don't think people knew Syndicate existed. I, I didn't even know it existed. Wait, were you even playing Perfect World then? What do you mean? I was playing Perfect World since the, like pretty early. Yeah, but I didn't know that. Syndicate existed then. Because I, I was on a break. And See? then my friend told me to play in Exactly, then you weren't playing Perfect World then. What do you mean? Like, if he told me to play in Syndicate, then I would have joined Syndicate, but he had no idea Syndicate existed. Well, that's because Syndicate died when Inception came, like before Inception came out, so. Oh, really? you, If you played Inception, you couldn't have played Syndicate because Syndicate wasn't alive anymore. It already closed down by then. That's what Damn. I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You weren't, you, you weren't playing when Syndicate was out. Damn. Unfortunate. I know. It is unfortunate. I, I ended up quitting in um, 2012 or 2011. That was a 1.3 servers. And then the next server I played was Inception. The only reason I found it was because I scored way down the private server list. What? <laughs> Damn. It was like at least number 10. I didn't have to scroll Damn. way down. You played Syndicate and Inception at the same time? Uh, no, but that was like... Yeah, but Syndicate was already on its last leg by then. Like, it was already ready to shut down. Yeah. So it was basically the life cycle of a private server at that time, I would say. I guess I have to complete these quests after all. Just for like 9k EX, I don't know if that's worth it. Yeah, I know, so that's what I'm saying, like... Like, if you were playing Inception, I don't think there was really an opportunity to play Syndicate. Like, even if you knew Syndicate back then, like, it was already basically ready to close. So it wouldn't have been any point to play it anyways. Alright, so I completed this tutorial. Get like 10k EXP, 34. Alright. Now, now we have what we need to continue. The preliminary quest has not been completed and has therefore been automatically accepted for you. Alright, that's what we needed. Damn. I need to be 34 before the next quest completes. So there's still a gap. There's a still a gap that they that they haven't fixed yet. All right, so now we go to the foothills.
Damn, Wizard was top tier on every private server? Damn. I guess on every private server he played. Damn. But he also played Inception and Vendetta. Both of which I didn't play. Well, I played Vendetta, but only the retail version. I guess version. Wizard was pretty damn good on Inception, since Spark was very overtuned. But then the slow channeling kind of sucks. We only had like, like, one good wizard on Inception, which was Ice T. Damn, but Inception is where all the good sins went. Damn, who was a good sin on Inception? I don't know. Damn, how could you spout these uh, things? Cause Teru, cause oh, yeah, Teru was. Neo, well, uh, to be honest, I didn't play when Teru played. So I, I don't Neo, know Neo played Inception and uh, he lost to Hisoka. Damn, I guess that's why Neo quit Inception. The dishonor. <laughs> he already quit by then. <laughs> but see, that that's why I assume there must have been good sins on uh, Inception. You know? Oh, yeah, Hisoka is pretty good. He was, he was probably number two. Well, if I don't include Teru, since I don't know him. Wait, Teru but, uh, was a sin? The gap between... I thought Teru was Wizard. No, the gap between Hisoka and Wizard and Ice-T was actually pretty big. No, I'm talking... No, uh, wait. You guys are talking about Wizard, I'm talking about Sin. Yeah, I know. It's uh, two different combos, bro. Wait, but Teru is a Wizard or a Sin? No, Teru's a Wizard. Oh, okay. I heard it was pretty good, but didn't play with him. Damn, I guess even See, on a private server where you're literally PKing every day, you still there's still people who you have never fought. Indeed. Well see, um the real question Neil asked was uh are you better than nice T? And that's a real good question. Hello. Thanks to the master. Well, I guess you guys didn't record enough 1v1s. You know. What do you mean? I guess this is the this is the hot spring quest. Damn, time to take a bath. Clean yourself up, you dirty. Hey. The, the hot spring quest. The hot, the beach episode. Damn. But so you can actually get get like get a hot spring in this game, and get into it whenever you want, though. So. This is us showing you that the possibilities that you can have in this game. Ah. Like,喜欢就多泡一会儿，不必赶时间。嗯，抱歉，为了我这一身伤，连累你也跟着东奔西跑。周南山一带向来有我神医道天宗圣公负责守护，你在我地界上出的事。我怎么能放着不管？只是。Ice <laughs> Wait, what? He was dying to me on physical marrow, dude. Yeah. What do you mean? He... I don't know. Chase, oh Chase was dying to me on physical marrow. I thought Chase was banned on Solid PW. Yeah, and that's why I banned him. Because he started getting ranked 9. Chase dog. <laughs> he was dying to me on physical marrow. Good me, and it's plus 12 weapons, so you can literally one shot me. Yeah. Dog chase on his own class. Damn, is Chase still here? Here he is. Oh. <laughs> I, I guess I still have him muted though. Because he was doing his own work. 
用邪术触怒凶娇，令其发狂。You wrecked me. 杀得生灵涂炭。I don't know about that one. 我这才知道，他们哪是敬畏挖荒一命，分明是将那凶娇的命门握在手中，为所欲为。一旦事发，就将责任全推到凶娇的狂性上头。枉费屈盟主多年来费心筹谋，终究还是没能为天下苍生消除这场大祸。结果，连他自己。All right, that this cutscene is way too long. Actually, I have footage of me wrecking you in on multiple classes, though, so I don't know what to say about that one. One more is there to upload. Recent fights, and I'm playing Swords of Legend. When did we fight? I don't even remember. I'm Chase still trying to play Perfect World when we have Swords of Legend released. As well as Elion. Multiple games coming up, but still trying to play PW. Alright, then this quest. Hmm. I probably have like about one hour. The question is am I gonna reach 37? I think I should. I'm, I think I'm on good track right now. Damn. To reach 37 within the next hour. So that would be, but that would still be like six, no, seven hours plus five hours. So it would be still be like 12 hours to reach uh, 37. If you know everything you're doing. So it's still not that easy. I'm level uh, 34. So you can tell up here. I don't know if you can see it. I'm, I'm only at 720p. But it's up here. Level 34. But right now, this is like, this should be where like the quests pick up. Like, every quest will give, like, 4k to 10k, I think. This guy is hard to kill. So the goal is really to just reach 37 by tonight, I think. Why do you want me to unmute you so badly, Chase? Alright, I'll mute you. What did you want to say? Yo, bro, I, I haven't been doing assignments, bro. What are you talking about? <laughs> then why were you humming to yourself? I was, I was, I was, I was, I was listening to music. Yeah, so that's doing assignments. Ow, bro. And well, bro, you gotta upload the recent fights of us, bro. I know you still have the footages. There was no recent fights. Wasn't Sakin an immediate wall skill? I don't know. Anthony, were you? What? Were you media wall skilled? Man. 
What is media wall wall skill? The what? Yeah. Were you? Meet oh meaty wall oh yeah yeah what? He said media waltz. I'm like, the fuck is that? Damn, do I talk too fast? Damn. Uh, 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 <laughs> hey, but Chinese, <laughs> Chinese people don't talk fast. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yes, we talk too fast, bro. Mm, no, we don't. What? I don't think Chinese is that fast. Damn, Dante, you have a love hate relationship with everyone. Dante is racist, dude. I don't know if that means he's racist necessarily. You're racist mother trucker, Dante. See, I hate this effect though. I hate how when you go stealth, it makes your screen blurry. Like, sure, I get that it wants to let me know that I'm in stealth, but... <clears throat> but I also want to be able to see my opponent, you know? So maybe that's another reason to not play this class. Damn, Chase is still studying. Bruh, how, dude? I know you're playing spell break. Are you playing spell break now? Yeah. Congrats. Yeah, I need pants for tomorrow's graduation, dude. I'm gonna come in there in my underwear. Wait, Aren't you renting a dress suit? Wait, you're not. I thought you were renting a dress suit. Oh no, I thought I'm, it. Aren't you losing a virginity as well? <laughs> what the fuck? Nah, oh, is that a separate day? Wayne is. Wait, 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 did, you, did you have a prom yet? Yeah, I did, I've been, I did have the prom. Um, oh, so you really lost your virginity. Yeah, bro, Wayne's the only virgin now, bro. And Anthony is speaking <laughs> from experience, Damn. I guess. Damn. Wayne, a virgin, bro. <laughs> I don't know what gave you that idea. <laughs> Damn, the fourth, the fourth cutscene. All right, got another meeting. BRB. I'll see you later, bro. All right, see ya. <laughs> Wait, so I. When are you gonna get back to Spellbreak? Hmm. I think I'm done with Spellbreak. Like, permanently or what? Probably. I mean, Swords of Legend is out now. Why play Spellbreak? Oh, I thought that's like. Beta though. What the fuck? Wait, what the fuck? What's going on? That was that's so weird. I couldn't attack that mob. You heard someone from Beijing? They talk kind of slow. Yeah, so then I don't know why I talk fast. Or do I even talk fast? Donkey. 
I'm from Beijing. So if you say people from Beijing talk slow, then... Wait, can I have a song request on your stream? I'm not even really listening. I'm not even listening to music right now. It's the one that says that Sean Brett like a diamond. Also, that's probably DMCA. I think I think we're not allowed to do song requests anymore because of DMCA. What the heck is a DMCA? Digital Millennia Copyright Act. Which is which is why nowadays people don't don't do song requests on their stream anymore, because they can only play non DMCA songs now. And any request to sound might be DMCA. Oh, why do I even know what DMCA stands for? <laughs> Why not? What? Why wouldn't you know what it stands for? It's the better question. Literally, if you search up DMCA, you will probably find a website or an article that tells you what it stands for. Oh, dang, it's already 103. I don't even feel too much, but I actually kind of do. I'm gonna watch your stream on my phone. Alright. Good night, Chase. No, no, I'm gonna be on call. You're probably gonna fall asleep, though. But that's fine. <laughs> you know what it means? Well, when you search up what it means, it will tell, also tell you what it stands for in the, like, the same article. So I don't know how you, like, you know... If you ever search it up, you kind of, like, to see it at the same time. I feel like you can't know one thing without knowing the other. Damn, you never searched it up. Well, well, you you had to search it up in order to like know about it, as a so you can o properly obey all the laws, you know. Purely off context. You don't make content. Well, damn, I guess never search it up from your uh, favorite creator or anything like that. That's okay, though. Damn, the mob, the AIs were just talking over each other, those NPCs. R.I.P. Well... Probably had to stop making video because of DMCA, you know. I hate it when you have to wait for the a a a NPC to like do an animation before you can proceed. Like, I'm just here jump jumping around. That's it. Yeah. 
You don't think I like the game? What? <laughs> what? Who pretends to like it for memes? Uh, that's not a real thing. If I didn't like the game, then why did I play it for one more day than Elion, you know? For Elion, I played it for three days in the close beta, but for this game, I played it for four days. I, I made two characters. Or I'm making the second character right now. I don't think that's a meme. Yeah, I wouldn't I would never make I would never do PvE for memes. You know? That's where I draw the line. I like memes more than Elia. <laughs> what? But I could have played one more day of Elia. There wasn't anything stopping me from doing it. I didn't have to. I didn't have to give up memes to play an extra day of Elia. Bro, why am I getting wrecked by these mobs? What is going on? Eldian had no memes? <laughs> Shaky Bay couldn't make memes of Eldian? Bruh. But I'm not making meme in this game. You're saying me playing it is for the memes. How can liking a game be a meme? I and mean, if it was that easy, then maybe Shaky Bay playing it could also be a meme. He doesn't even have to make memes, he doesn't have to play it. Based on what you're saying, and at least. Can you keep up with me? Mommy always said demons were stupid and couldn't even speak Chanchu. Can you keep up with me? The meme of Solo was so strong, Shaggy Bay couldn't play it for more than one day. It was meme to meme god. Bruh. I mean, him quitting was probably the meme. So me playing wouldn't be a meme. Because the meme is to quit. Not to play. But then again, you also didn't like Swordsman Online, so maybe maybe your taste is just the problem here. Ten people like Source but not lying. Nah, way more than ten.
the game had like multiple lobbies when they first released. Yep. I remember when the game first released. It had like like the list was full of people doing doing uh, arena. And that was just arena too. Well, you know what? The game is still alive in EU. But that's besides the point. Just because people don't like it now doesn't mean they didn't like it once before. So. Because the whole point of what I'm saying is that people used to like it. It, that's like saying no one likes Perfect World because everyone eventually quit Perfect World, you know? So just because people stopped playing it doesn't mean they didn't like it. children i realized that the people in the southern regions who play with snakes and poisons are involved in mysticism and not the magic you should take this seriously i guess mysticism is like but just listen the Damn. ability to absorb living souls is a divine skill possessed by the goddess nua at the time, the word of mysticism said that it could be used to draw Zhang Yu demon parasites out of possessed bodies and then seal them away. I guess this is lore of the faction wars. Mysticism versus heaven's children. But in the end, they aren't as strong as living souls. However, there's no proof of that. We're listening to it right now. The lore of the faction wars. Then we need to be able to defend ourselves better. That means we need to be able to completely destroy evil. But they never want to completely destroy the demon parasites. They just want to seal them away. For what? If they're just pretending to seal them away, and are instead secretly collecting lots of demon parasites so that they can eventually feed them back into Zhang Yu's... Yeah, I'm doing no damage now. These monsters are so tanky. Catastrophe. I'm only killing them one at a time. When Zhang Yu was born, my mortal parents and relatives all died at the same time. Damn. His entire family died at the same time. That must suck. What the fuck? What? What is this debuff? Damn, this must be the debuff that this scroll I saw earlier was meant to clean. All right. Actually, let me just kill them one at a time. Just need to kill two more. Damn, I got two stacks of that thing now. Damn, this guy is AoEing. All of them. I guess my classes suck. What is going on? I cannot kill an AoE this many people. This many mobs. Damn, is this bad at PvE? Oh, a spirit fox.
I've already but you know, Dante, there's also multiple other people who like the game, so... I don't know what to tell you, man. I can pretty much have to kill these guys one by one. And I mean more than people who have, uh... Like, the uh, Elia and Lost Ark so far. Well, I mean, people are still playing it, so... Even preferring Albion. So you may be addicted to Lost Ark, but that doesn't mean that I'm memeing when I like the game. Especially hard to like Lost Ark when it's not even out. Today's meetings are quicker than expected. Oh, that's always a good thing. Lost Journal of the Devastator. Letter from Maijia Servant. Damn. Leaving someone's journal. Yep. Invasion well, of so privacy. Well, when you die, your journal becomes your legacy. So maybe you should put things in your journal that are worth remembering. Damn. Too bad my journal will be empty because nothing worth remembering. That's unfortunate. Let's see, what do you think, Anthony? How's this game compared to Elia? Bro, I didn't even watch Elion. Damn! Oh, that's just unfortunate then. Damn. Maybe I should have watched Elion. Maybe. Just trying to prove that I'm not memeing. Why? Because Dante thinks you're memeing? Yep. <laughs> this game will die not too much longer after release. I mean, it's going strong in China for four years, so. Damn, it's actually going strong in China? Uh huh. Damn! But I guess the Chinese people actually know what, what the hell is actually going on. Like, what's a golden shell? I don't Whereas know, Count man. The same about uh, the English audience. Well, that's why it's up for us to figure out. You know, how games developers, they always, like, put in some uh, hidden mechanic that the players have to figure out, you know? It's like that. Damn. We, we the players, need to figure out what golden shell is. See, I believe it's a reference to, uh, uh, to, uh, to the Chinese technique. Where you can, uh, deflect blades with your skin. 
Damn. I guess it could be. But then the question is... How do you activate it? See, maybe it's permanently activated. The reason why you're doing so low damage is uh, when you aim your cursor, you're aiming at the wrong body part. What? I don't even have a cursor. What do you mean? The, the, you uh, see this? Look, look, there's no cursor. Damn. There's no cursor in this I thought game. You, I thought you would at least have a dot. No, there's no cursor in this game. It's actually pretty weird. Damn. Damn. Usually on games, like, I don't know, like, BDO, Swordsman Online, they all have a cursor, but this game doesn't have a cursor. Damn. Maybe they just forgot to add it. Damn. I think it's a requirement that game developers should actually play their own uh, game. China has low standard because they don't even get the best MMOs. Wait, what do you mean by that? They don't even get the best MMOs. Damn. I kind of hate Korean MMOs, though. I mean, game developers play their own MMO. Or play their own game. Or else, how are they going to make it? They have to play it in order to develop No, I mean, it. like, as a pastime. That's a pastime? Like, it's a uh, compulsory. <laughs> Compulsory pastimes, I guess. Yes. But then, I guess you will never be able to develop more than one game. So, that's kind of bad. I thought it went, uh, working as a developer, you can only develop one game at a time. No, you need to... You're under multiple yep. contracts what the no like as soon as you finish developing one game you would immediately move on to a project to develop another one yeah then you just quit the original game but then that wouldn't meet your uh, requirement you know what that would that wouldn't pass your requirement for them to play it as a pastime in. what you're playing as pastime way as a developer no as soon no but see as soon as you um finish developing a game you you move on to another game so as soon as the no, game releases, you just move on. No, as, as long game. as you're employed by the company, right? You have to play the game. Yeah, so then you wouldn't be able to develop multiple games. That's the problem. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, are you gonna be on multiple contracts? Like one with each different company developing? No, the same game? company developing multiple games. Happens all the time. Oh, that's what you mean. Why can't I go to Cloud Top? Yeah, I, I guess that's true. Happens all the time. Maybe they need to like carve out like a, a work period. Damn. Like instead of working eight hours a day, you work seven, but one hour has to be actually playing the game. Damn. <laughs> and if we're working on multiple games, then uh, you just lose more hours. Damn. I guess if you would just uh, develop. Like, as soon as you work at the company, to the point where you develop eight games, you just never uh, work again. You just play uh, one game every hour, until, and that's your work. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so then I guess once you develop I mean... seven games, you get fired. <laughs> but I mean, I would imagine it's not incentivized for developers to be developing, like, multiple games. Of course it is. You want the know. you want the best developers to develop new games, and then you want the uh, not so good developers to maintain their old games. Damn. Wait, why am I up here? Hmm. I thought you were taking a block. I guess I wasn't supposed to fall down. That was the wrong move, apparently. Damn, I guess you died. Apparently, Even you have a sword. You can fly one. Apparently, that was the wrong move. Jumping down from the clouds kills you instantly. Today, I learned. Damn.
But what was this? Gather leather from Young Lee. Oh, that's just another collectible. What am I supposed to do? Kill this? Am I supposed to kill a s small snow sprite? I think I'm actually killing a small snow sprite. That's unfortunate. Damn. I guess you have a soft spot in your heart, in your heart for small snow sprites. Well, you're killing a. Uh... Small animals that are white, you know. Damn. I guess sprites aren't really animals. Black, would it be better? Nope. But snow is white, though, so. <clears throat> it's like you wouldn't. It's like a black rabbit isn't any worse than a white rabbit, unless you're like um, I don't know. Actually, no. That's but people cats. say black cats are worse than uh, that's, white cats. Yeah, that's a superstition. I don't. I don't even know how that superstition makes any sense. But I guess superstition doesn't have to make sense. supposed to go now what the fuck I can't talk to this guy hmm. it's weird how sometimes I have to demount whereas flying doesn't uh, let me talk to them yes I'm supposed to go to cloud paw I was supposed to be here I don't know why it didn't work the first time Anyway, I came here too early the first time. Damn, here too early, I guess. Uh, oh, you know what they say. Being early isn't always as good as being there at the right time. Damn, another faith scene. Oh wait, this is like one of the uh, arena maps, or at least one of the arena maps is based off this. Damn, I guess that's why I'm not like losing anything from dying. Because I'm still a combat school novice. Damn. Guess death is punishing later on. Unfortunate. Damn, but I feel like, like early on, like all of this, it's just like, you can't just skip them. I feel like there's no real reason to like do do this much quest if the gameplay doesn't really start until later on. I guess you're finding new PW Private Star until Lost Ark releases. What? I mean, you you can find PW Private Service if you want, but PW is a dead game now, unfortunately. We had enough. Meanwhile, of PW. meanwhile, I will be playing solo.
But you can you and Chase can play PW. Damn. Chase released a new PW video. He misses PW. Of him getting rolled on Epic. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> Damn, I guess you watched it. <laughs> Not for long, I won't. It. I mean it comes like the close beta is one week and it comes out in the summer, so. It's gonna be out by the uh, before April August ends. Damn. I hope the translations and everything improves. Uh, we just have to figure it out. Like uh Damn. like how good players are. A puzzle do it. game and an MMO combined into one. And oh, close in the fall, nah. It's not gonna close in the fall. Like I said, it's it's a good game in China. Grand opening, grand close. So. <laughs> oh look, it's a seal Ori Kankos. What? I guess. It's a seal. I guess. <laughs> Damn. <clears throat> this, this game's actually the best. Puzzle game, MMO, and a Yu-Gi-Oh card. See? Dante hasn't even gotten into the Yu-Gi-Oh games yet. I think I pretty much figured out how to play the game this, now. This is literally a card game as well. It's the matching one you were playing in prison. I know, I'm pretty, sure I, I'm pretty sure I figured out how to play the game now. Damn. It's well, just, it's time for you to uh, start wagering actual gold <laughs> it's just very hard to play because you have to memorize all the cards damn you don't they have time to look at that monetize it. monetize yes i you, guess you play get for money. pro at the card game you play damn. for money like poker oh you know you can probably play for real money in game maybe exactly. that maybe that's how you gear up you just challenge people to card games <laughs> indeed it's it's like how there's like PvP bets on PWI, but here you have parking bets. Exactly. Then you have to start like adopting strange tactics, like losing the first two games, and then going big on the third one where you actually Damn, try. Becoming a chess hustler. Yes. Damn, but doesn't everyone already know that tactic by now? Does it still work? Well... I guess there's always I people who don't so. know. People, I mean, greed is a very real thing that, yeah. does, that will not go away. I mean, you, you still get people getting scammed through phone calls or emails, so... But that's probably just because of ignorance. No, I think most of it's from greed as well. Isn't it mostly from old, old people who get scammed though? What? I mean, old people is definitely the demographic, but I yeah, imagine but like... the young ones get also get scammed. Really? Huh. Yes. I wasn't aware of that. I thought it was mostly old people. Damn. Due to uh, not knowing that it's a scam. Damn, but you see, old people have been alive for longer, so they they have more experience with other scams. It's just a new, uh, today it's delivered in a new medium, which is like emails or phone calls. Yeah, but they don't get the uh, they don't get the technology, you know. Yeah, but I mean, the concept is uh, still there. So uh, maybe not. All right, let's. I mean, back this. in the days, I would imagine it's not as easy to like just send all of your money off offshore right so maybe like it would be different hey you're a nigerian prince yep <laughs> Damn. no but like that that scam only works if you can like send your money offshore like really quickly and i don't think back in the days that would be like that easy or would it i don't know See, young people get scammed the least, but 25 to 34, 35 to 44, 45 to 54, and 55 to 64, they're all very similar. Damn. That's OP. 
Whereas 18 to 24 is uh, half of everything else. Just because something is successful in China doesn't mean it'll be successful here. I mean, that's true. But it's a good indication that it would be successful here. Yeah. I mean, just because uh, Lost Ark was successful in uh, Korea doesn't mean it's going to be successful, successful here either. So it goes both ways. It's good that you're here. Damn, level 35. I mean, Perfect World was good in China and it was good here. So. Was PW actually good here though? Or was it just like a niche? No, PW was a pretty good game, I think. Like, well, what was the of... population compared to WoW and RuneScape? I don't know, but lots of people know about it. Damn, really? Yeah. I didn't know that. No, I'm pretty sure people know about it. But most of them like never got an endgame. Like they just played it a bit. But uh, like most people never got the endgame, but most people know of, of it. Like they played it for I guess a bit at true. least. To be honest, I didn't get endgame either. Yeah. I just escaped to our private server. Check. Lost Ark is super yeah. hyped here. I mean that's debatable. Yeah. The Lost Ark uh, Reddit and uh, Discord isn't really any more active than Elion right now, to be honest. In fact, Elion yeah. might be more active. <clears throat> and people lose interest fast. If it doesn't come out within like the next few months, people might just forget about it entirely. I mean, is hype, but I'm saying, like, compared to, um, Lost Ark and Solo, I don't know. Like, I feel like the Lost Ark Discord isn't really actually that active in comparison. The sentry has not been taken care of. Go and find Hui Yan. Well, that's the problem. The longer you hear about it, the more time it is for the hype to die down. It's like Blade and Souls. Bleed and Souls was super hyped when we heard about it, but then never released. And then when it actually did release, it just died immediately. Because that they waited too long, so. So you could go that route as well. But it was super hyped. If it, if it released um, when it was hyped, then it might have not died so much. But when it released, the game was already... Uh, the hype already died down. was populated I mean I did play it I don't know if it was as populated as uh, you would expect for a hyped game though I guess you get the invincible if you kill the mob without getting hit. Purple to Swordsman on release. <clears throat> mm, 
sounds about right. Well, I mean, Lost Ark was also hyped, so... That's what I'm saying. People could still quit could still quit Lost Ark on the day off. Because they might also feel like Lost Ark has no content. So that's what I'm saying, like, if, if a game being popular in China doesn't indicate it will be popular here, then the game being hyped here doesn't indicate it will also be good on release. Well, that's... content is subjective, though. So, you might think it has more content, but other people might not. A lot of people say BDO has uh, like infinite content because of life skill and such. So, damn, I still don't even know what life skill is. You know, like cooking. Damn, it's not. Well, people say that, so it's all subjective. Wait, how did I teleport out? Oh my god. I did not mean to teleport out. Not to teleport back. How do I get back? You've got to be kidding me. Damn. Or you've got to be kidding me. I can't teleport back now. Video has little life skill content, but see, that's subjective though. Some people think it's a lot of content, even overwhelming, in fact. Damn, unskippable cutscene. People on Reddit. People on YouTube comments, etc, etc. I'm not saying random things, I'm saying things that I have read. Damn, look at this guy, he has 14 blades. He's a BDO ninja. Damn, have, have you watched that movie? 14 Blades? Nope. Damn. Oh, back to janitorial duty. I guess you're right. You have to first become a janitor before you can become a student. Hmm. Damn. <laughs> GG. Because this is what you have to do at level 35 in order to get to level 37. Cooking that grew 50, I'll be able to progress further and not, it's not progress, it's not content. Well, the whole thing was figuring out how to optimize your cooking and life skill process and like the whole, uh, like your whole cycle or whatever they call it. The life skill rotation, you know, that's content for people. You know what they say, content is about the journey, not the destination. Damn, who says that? Day. The fuck? What's day? Have you never heard of day, the sayer of things? No. That's where you're missing out then. Damn, I'm just getting memed. <laughs> what? No, I'm not memeing. Min maxing and content is not the same thing. I mean, 
That's that's what people say. Like people people like the content. I don't know what to tell you, man. Unless unless I'm I'm not gonna like start screenshotting every sentence I read. Or maybe I should. Like just every time I read a comment, I screenshot it and, and file it into See, my uh This is why cabinet. people on Epic screenshot everything. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's kind of silly, though. See, on Epic, <laughs> if you die in a 1v1, it gets screenshotted. Yeah, but that's because people just blatantly lie on EPW for some reason. I guess it's just the culture. See, this is why Chase is, uh, will be a good EPW player. <laughs> yeah. There are two places you can grind wolf meat, such content. I mean, I, I guess I should just have a filing cabinet of what people say and screenshot it every time, so. Who knows? Not just CPW, PW in general? Ah. Uh, I don't know if it's PW in general. I feel like on per on uh, Dreamweaver, people like didn't really care nearly as much about how who who won how many fights. Damn, that takes screenshots to be one v one. I can't tell you how many <laughs> times you have to be in when it's not true. Damn. Um. Well, everybody who plays private server is also the EPW player, though. But if you like, you know, you have to look at official servers, then I think it's different. I don't think anyone on Dream we were like really ever cared about score or anything like that. Wait, I got I got trolled. I don't need to kill these guys. Fuck. Your private servers? Well, everyone who plays private server is also a UPW player. That's the thing. But see, that's the sad thing, though. Like, people only ever made videos just to prove they killed someone, not for actual content. So, PW is just full of videos of shit content. Of people putting no effort into their videos. I think Epic has daily mass PK videos. It's just yeah, about but, a but bunch of archers ganking. Yeah, but it's like just check content though. Indeed, it's so boring. I don't know how people watch it. I don't and think any. I don't think anyone comments. watch it. That's the thing. And then you see all these comments like jerking off the leader. They're like, oh my god, did we beat them? They suck. Yeah, I don't, I don't think anyone watched them, that's the thing. The sad thing is that, like, PW has no good content, like, has no good videos as content because people only ever make videos just, like, to prove that they beat someone for their ego. As opposed to actually making good videos for, good, for like, people to enjoy. Even though there's so many people making them, none of them are actually good because of that. Oh wait, some of them just give it to me for free. The fuck? That's OP. New Astro Blessing. So, the duration of Dustbringer. Wait, what the fuck is Dustbringer again? Um. Fuck. I need to hit something.
can you can I can never find a mob when I need it. Love on ice. Yeah. yeah. It's a pretty popular thing to do. What? You make love on ice? That's popular? No, you don't make love on ice. Like, uh, you know, you take your date out to go skating. I heard I heard that's a pretty popular thing to do, you know. Yeah, maybe in Canada. Damn. I guess not in Australia. No snow in Australia, huh? Indeed. I thought you had snow in the summer, though. What? You don't? We get snow in the summer? What? Yeah. Bro, our summers are like 40 degrees Celsius. What? Bushes are on fire. No, like my summer. It's your, it's your winter. Oh, then it's like right now. Yeah, no like snow. Right now. No it's snow? just cold. Yeah, it's just cold. That sucks. We don't deal with snow problems. That's it's cold sucks. problems. You don't get to enjoy the beauty of snow. I guess the only time you'll see snow is in uh, Solo. Down. This is snow right now. Good players didn't make content on PW. Damn. I mean, they did though. This, all they did was just post uh, bad, bad uh, videos. So, which is what I was talking about. Like people make content, but only to prove that they kill some people. So, well, PK video is content, so I, I did make content. If you can watch it, it's content. Not necessarily good have, content, but it's still uh, content. They spend like two weeks hassling the guy for 1v1. Then they record it. Then they spend like a whole day editing the video. They upload it. And still no one believes them. <laughs> that, that's actually kind of unfortunate. <laughs> Guides? Now, anything that you can watch is content, man. Damn, commentaries. PW explain I am up. Yeah, but that's not really the definition of content. Damn, this game can has so much content to create. You can explain what a golden show is. True. Except I don't even know what it is, so how can I explain it? Well, see, once you find out, you make a video, it's gonna go viral. Everyone's yeah. gonna watch it. Damn, I guess it's time to figure it out. I guess that will be that needs to be the goal for the next uh, next week. Figure out what a golden shell is. Maybe even download the Chinese version and try it on the Chinese version. <laughs> Damn. All to figure out the mystery of the golden shell. It's amazing how video has so many content creators with no content. Well, maybe video has content though. Like I said, it's, it's subjective. One person's trash is another person's content. You know what they say. Yeah. The, these are quotes that people say. Yeah, but the actual quote is treasure, not content. <laughs> no, these, these are quotes that people say. <laughs> you, you, just, you just subbed out treasure with content. <laughs> This isn't even an argument. Well, clearly it is. That's why we're talking about it.
Stop memeing, bruh. That's because that's because all they do is grind every day. Of course, there's no content when they are already max gear. But for a new player, that's a different story. Or if they, you know, stop grinding and join in the PvP sometime. But everyone's too lazy to do that. Well, not even lazy, they're just addicted to grinding. It's figuring out what to grind, how to grind, what gear to go for, etc. See, take any new player. They will say the game is over. Like, they generally say the game is overwhelming if you go on Reddit. And just like, look at what new players say. Like, I, I don't have screenshots of these stuff, so. Like, I, I'm not I'm not here just screenshotting everything and putting in the filing cabinet, so. Damn, maybe time for you to start. Winning internet arguments. Just, just have a list <laughs> in the filing cabinet. Damn, I have a little quest here now. Hmm. So I guess I go back to Cloud Rise. Do I really need to be Max though? I wonder. What happened to defeat the Devastators and Awakeners on Snowdrift Plateau? I already did all of them apparently. Just like just what? now, literally just now. Damn. I guess. The only overwhelming thing about the game is then let's going to catch up to players at Wales every. Worker system. Bruh. Maybe the meta is just to hire two Pinoys. When the Pinoy is sleeping, the other Pinoy takes over. I mean, that that's only once you already know how everything works and you're only doing that to PvP, etc, etc. But see, people like learning about the worker empire. Like I said, this week, it's all subjective. Eh, worker empire. Like, you might not like a puzzle game, but that doesn't mean puzzle games are bad. There are people who like puzzle games. Damn, like, cut the rope. Or even Candy Crushers isn't even a puzzle game. Damn, my mom likes Candy Crush. That's why content is subjective. And I mean, the whole point of this is to... The whole point we're even talking about this is to figure out whether Lost Ark would actually be popular on release or not anyways. Or be alive on release or not anyways, so... Meanwhile, Lost Ark... We haven't even heard of a closed beta yet. So that's actually zero content. Maybe the developers are too, uh, too, um, money hungry. <laughs> I've got to go back to the terrace of the hanging sword now. Mm. I've got to work. Wait, they they still haven't fixed this though. I'm I'm at level thirty six and now the quest again. Unfortunate. Damn, I guess I'm not gonna get manage to get level thirty seven today. Very unfortunate. Fuck. Yeah, I have nothing now. Everything is done. I 
Okay, these are all done. What else is what else is left? This game isn't even up to date and has more content than BDO or Lost Ark or Solo. Damn, what do I do now? I guess... Wait, you just get f like f what? You just get five crystal dust every day for free. Solo has more content than BDO. I mean, I think it does, but other people might not. That's kind of why you're saying it's gonna die, right? Because if it has more content, objectively, then it wouldn't die. So. If it dies, then it's subjective. What am I... What do I even do now, though? I guess there's nothing to do, but... It's just easier cultivation... Just like washing I, hands. Like I guess I can, no, that's not good. This isn't good. Uh, this I already finished. This I also finished. These are locked. This one is good, I guess, 10k. This one is good, I guess, 13k. 12k. 20, oh, 29k. I guess, I guess we could do some biography quests, but... Maybe not today, though. Maybe today is time to sleep, Sue. There is one thing I wanted to try, though. Um, I was going to try to see if I can escape jail and then queue into arena without dying. I think, I think I'll get level 37 tomorrow on Reaper instead. I'm going to be right back and then do a test after I come back. Alright, I'm back. The game can't die for more reason than lack of content. Oh yeah. 
But like I'm just saying, like if the people's main complaint end up being a lack of content, then that just goes to show. But that like content is probably the main reason why anyone would quit or not quit, I think. Because if we're talking like, I don't know, graphics, animations, those are very vanity based, I feel like, so. Who knows though. Okay, so what I wanted to figure out was hmm. Whether or not I will be able to escape and then queue into arena. Or whether me being negative karma also prevents that. But first why am I I'm still debuffed. Huh. Wait, so might actually just be fucked though. Mechanics and optimization more important than content. Optimization. Well, I don't know about optimization. Right now I'm at 100 FPS. But I'm also on Ultra. So it's a bit worse than BDO. I guess if we like try high, how much better does it become? Let's see. Um, nothing changed. <laughs> Wait, what? Damn. There was no change at I all. Guess high is ultra. Let's try normal. Wait, I'm I'm not seeing any change. What's going on? Maybe click apply. I did click apply. Damn. Wait, is this bugged? Oh no, wait, here it is. Okay, that's pretty noticeable. It only increased by like 10 FPS, 10 to 20 FPS. Minimal? Damn, speed. Minimal is like, okay, minimal is like 144 to 150. All right, so I, so, so yeah, the optimization isn't that great because on minimal is kind of where what I'm getting on remastered on BDO. I mean, but I think that's a known issue though. The developer said, uh, well, the GM said that they're aware of the issue and they're in contact with the developer, but there's no, uh, no word on when that will be possible yet. But sure, but I guess in terms of if people's computer can run it, I guess they could just run a minimal. People play on optimization on BDO and don't really complain about that. So, so wait, I actually can't even escape now either, or can I? Because I have this uh, stat debuff, even though even though I came back to jail. And I'm still uh, being hunted and... Uh, Shrouded in negative chi and everything. What if I take this quest? Does it remove the debuffs? No, it doesn't. So these debuffs are just still on me. Alien content was amazing. I mean, it was okay. I don't think it was necessarily amazing, though. I mean, I didn't think the game wasn't good because of mechanics. Alone. In fact, mechanics... Alone is like would be acceptable if it also had the content of not being able to gear up from pvp so so content kind of makes a difference in that case okay so i'm just fucked like i can't even escape now because i have this debuff so so like 
So wait, how, how you... There's like no way to even escape then. Or... Because as soon as... If you get caught at like 150, you're always... You're permanently debuffed with this. Unless you... Unless you raise your karma back up. Or key, your evil key back up. So... Even if I try to escape now, it would be harder than when I tried at first. Because it would be... I would have this penalty. I'm not even doing damage to this guy now. That's a bad excuse to quit the game because of no PvP here. Well, not necessarily a bad excuse. It's it's just my reason. It's not really an excuse. No, Elgin doesn't have the option. You have to do dailies. It's basically Archage. And Archage was bad because if you miss, like, you have to, like, always be on top of your dailies on Archage. If you miss, like, one day, yours is behind. So I think this is just impossible with these debuffs on. And even if I die, I don't think they remove the debuff. Which I'm probably gonna die at this rate. You can get gear from open world PvP. Um, not really. Opro PvP gives you, like, the honor points. And then with the honor point, all you can do with it is to, like, trade for, like, these exchange scrolls. You need, like, the honor medal or whatever to get gear. And that's not from open world PvP. That's from, like, specific events and such. Like, daily events. So basically daily quests. Let's see if I can take these guys down still. That like that was the biggest problem because I played Archage, and having to be forced to do dailies was just not good on our SR on Archage. These guys are yeah, these guys are not dying at all. Yeah, maybe because they're not students, they are adepts. <laughs> I mean they're student adept. Well, better than student. Damn. They are like 36 levels higher than you are. Actually, I think they're the same level as me. That's what they want you to think. Damn. I have to, I have to like be like stun locking them here. And they're still like, they're still killing me. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. They killed me as they were dying. Unfortunate.
I guess that's the reason why they are adepts. Yeah, there's like there's just there just isn't any way. Under the under these conditions. <laughs> that's just play of intuition. <laughs> I mean I pretty much killed like eight mobs with 2k HP and 30% uh, of my damage. So you know. Not much better the I can do. The question is, uh, why does this jailing mechanic even exist in the first place? Because you're not supposed to RPK. You're supposed to do... You're supposed to queue up for PvP that they designed. You know? Damn! How did Vaughn get jailed then? He tried to did RPK. RPK? Yeah, he did. Damn! Uh... Did you have to kill someone to get jailed or just one attack? Well, as soon as you go into RPK mode, you immediately start losing karma. So technically, you don't have to kill anyone. But if you kill someone, then yeah, it drops it by a lot. Damn. Can't RPK can only be queued for PvP at certain times? Can't talk that's right than Alion or Lossar. Well, I mean, I guess it works for me. Because I can just stop playing at 1 a.m. But Damn, I guess for you, sleep. not so much. Damn, I, I guess this is why Wayne wants to play this game. It, it puts a cap on his sleep schedule. Off by 1 a.m. That's that's not how it works, no. Whereas other games, he'll play till like 7 a.m. in the morning and then no. wake up at work for 9. <laughs> that's not how it works. <laughs> well... <laughs> I guess I was just say okay. For the night. Because Damn. that's about it. You have the AFK at work as well. Yep, AFK at work, AFK for the night. Damn. And uh get level 37 on Reaper tomorrow. I guess that's about it for the stream tonight. Well Damn. time to go sleep then. Alright, see ya. Alright, thanks everyone for watching. Good night. Alright, see ya. Gonna be ending stream now.